me, me. Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Saturday Night Insanity. Stonehenge. Several inches of stony amazingness. Stonehenge. Alright. Let me just uh, move this a little bit. Yeah, huh. Yeah, uh, sure, that, that works, kind of. All right, let's bring the boys into the town of Snee. Somebody. <laughs> there we go. Hi. Hi. Oh, that's what I knew was going to be here. I mean, just caught Stout <laughs> serenading everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. We were we were singing the Galaxy Rangers theme in the hangout. Oh, I excellent! We were full house, and then right. Brandon said the word "full house," and everybody started singing the full house theme. Song. Because oh, we had I... nine people before he showed up, which means you're the tenth, and well, no, they have no. no more room. So what sorry that I missed that. Yeah, Brandon goes, "Oh, we have a full house tonight," and Zach goes, "Everywhere you look." <laughs> and <I> sighed, <laughs> just like that. Uh huh. And, and, and that was the start. And Eric was telling us about listening to the Galaxy Rangers theme while he used to mow his lawn on a ride on lawnmower <laughs> <laughs> for five hours. I'm just, and... I'm just imagining the shot of the yard, with the epic music playing, and the lawnmower just like, <laughs> "No guts, no glory." <laughs> Far away from here. <laughs> the last one came. Sorry. Was it like a John Deere kind of thing, Eric? Yeah, oh, three John Deere saber. Nice. We go. had one of those at our at our house, Sean, and I used to drive it quite a bit. We did. I liked mowing the lawn because I could pretend <coughs> to be an action driving superstar as I <laughs> accidentally mowed over the flowers that someone decided to plant <laughs> in the middle of the lawn. Said, oh, it'll be pretty. It's like they're in the middle of the fucking lawn. <laughs> <laughs> so every time I, I did the lawn, I made sure to mow over at least two of them. That was my goal. And I thought, eventually, they will all be gone. I so said, right here. Oops, I just clicked one guys. of them. Oops. I've got self-censorship. <laughs> well, I remember, like, one year we had, like, a big war over that going on where, yes. like, our parents wanted them because they thought it was pretty. But the problem is we couldn't mow any of the grass around it. Yes. So we just had a nice manufactured yard and then this one area of just like overgrown abandoned house with, with like a flower there. in the middle of it <laughs> <laughs> so finally I remember one day our grandpa got so frustrated with like the lack of progress in that I looked outside and he was on the John Deere in a pouring rainstorm <laughs> mowing the flowers down <laughs> good he's like, how did, he's like I'm getting rid of these fucking flowers <laughs> 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 Yeah. War of the Roses. <laughs> yeah. In this case, I think it was tulips, but okay. Uh, and it was actually they were annoying, whatever they were. It was funny with our driveway, too, because we had a really like steep hill down the road. Yeah. And so I remember if you ran the throttle on the high end setting, the engine brakes would kick in to kind of keep you from speeding, and then would eventually just let go for no reason. Oh, that's right. It's like, oh shit! <laughs> As Sean put it, it's like it's like the John Deere was going. Well, it's your funeral. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Engine disengaged, neutral, I down the you hill. Like, ass, like standing at the window, opening up the curtain and looking. And here's Sean going, ah! <laughs> <laughs> flying past the window. <laughs> Uh, actually, was about one it, story yeah. I remember was uh, one time Sean was working in the backyard. Uh, I think he was vacuuming the pool. And With the I lawnmower? Was... Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Driving I know, I'm... around the room. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've never been rich. I've never owned a pool. What the oh. fuck do you mean vacuuming the pool? Well, all the like, shit that gets at the bottom. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, vacuum, like, like an actual yeah. vacuum. Oh yeah, yeah. There's like a special pool vacuum that like. Oh is... fuck! I don't fucking look. I, like yeah. I said, I've I've been poor my whole I'm, life. I have no I'm idea. Explaining it to you. It looks like a manta ray with a handle and just kind of like flaps on the bottom. Yeah. Well, we in that case, around. Around. So, well, in this case, it was manual. It wasn't. They weren't so rich they could afford the auto pool vacuum. Mm. Uh, this had to be 
you know, operated by a human. But, uh, but yeah, it's basically just a vacuum. It's just like a vacuum thing, just on a big, long stick, so you can reach the bottom, and you just suck up all the crap at the bottom and the algae on the sides and stuff like that. And yeah, so there you go. And it just sucks into Park like some filter like a, thing. Mobile Home Park I grew up in had like a, a group pool, like a, a pool area, but oh yeah, that was it, you know. Hmm. Not crazy. So, yeah, pretty cool. So I just like to say uh, I'm a fucking idiot because I'm here. Oh, okay. And the reason I say that is because... Uh, we all agree. Uh, you know, there's this, this wonderful, intelligent, funny, uh, you know, close-ish to my age woman that I've been flirting with mercilessly at work for a very long time. Oh, and no, uh, no. she's going on vacation for a week. And occasionally she has wine and cheese parties with her uh, other lady friends. And uh, she's having one tonight, right now, and invited me. And I said, oh, I can't. I've got my live show tonight. <laughs> oh, my God. Go so here I am. You fucking idiot. My dedication to you guys, like the fucking idiot I am, so... If you had a cell yeah. phone, you could just call and fix that problem. Yeah, like, heck, I hey, know. can I, I change my mind? Can I, you know, yeah. come over? <laughs> <laughs> and just bail on us and leave us live until you get back. So... <laughs> that went so awesome. there you go. Like, okay, we recorded the show while we're, we're just doing our thing, and you come back afterwards. Yeah, we're, we're, all, we're all about you, man. Come back, and drunk, on wine. And when John comes back, he'll have a cheese. new pickup. The big, <laughs> ah, oh, big stupid goofy grin on my face. Ah, uh, yeah. So anyway, that's that's my idiot idiotic moment of the week. Thank you, thank you very much. Way to go. Moment of the week. So anyway, I'm a hopeless romantic. I just get myself in trouble. Yeah. Yep. Wait a second. Cast just left. Did he go take your place? I think he did. <laughs> Wine and cheese. I'm there. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Shit, he's only like an hour's drive away too. He conceivably Son of a could. Bitch. <laughs> yes, I, I'm I'm the surrogate Sean for the evening, so I'll uh, I'll be filling in for him while he does geeky things like an idiot. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Ah. Uh, so we got a lot of folks here. Is Ryan actually here, or did he just log in and then go take a dump? Yeah, uh, <laughs> step away for a minute. Okay. All right. Family That's business. Fine. I know! Skeleton Boner's like, dude! Cheese! What's wrong with you? I know. And cheese. Wine, bro. And wine! Yeah, like, <laughs> like, people are going, uh, someone's yeah. Someone's gonna provide you with drink. So they're, I, they're asking to revoke you your main card. got drunk on someone else's dime, you idiot. <laughs> What's wrong with you? So I told her that <laughs> I would totally... And she said, uh, formal, uh, attire. So I said, ah, oh, fuck. And I totally would have gone, too. And I would have worn my best jogging pants with only the one hole in the crotch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what you have to yeah. But, play uh, play yeah. <laughs> play a player. Yeah. Oh yeah, I got it going on, man. You know when you said that when you described the jogging pants scenario, uh-huh. all I could think is I don't want to rape anybody. I just <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. That's the greatest fucking night. Oh my god. <laughs> That was like the last great Stickam night before Stickam went tits up. And we <laughs> got so most of fun. it immortalized in a recording, so, so <laughs> most of fun. it is oh there. Yeah. I just oh, posted a video of so Oh, drunk! Perfect, perfectly <laughs> sums up my thoughts towards Sean right now. Oh, yep. God. You were so drunk. Anybody oh, in the chat oh, I know. It's the Billy Madison. Like, I've never <sighs> seen you that drunk before or since. <laughs> yeah, I need to go back and watch you were, that. was pretty you drunk. You were blitz shit house. You were two levels of drunk. <laughs> oh, I know. You were, blitz, you, were you were blitz and shit house somehow. Uh, I Remember, know. Was that worse than the, uh, the shelf building drunk? Oh, it was way so, worse. Hold on, let me just... I mean, you, I think the only closest thing would be, like, maybe the tequila, tequila worms. You I guys can... Yeah. So, that was so, pretty bad. So, hold on, I'm just going to watch... What he thought his secondary camera was the funniest thing in the world. <laughs> Hold on, I'm just gonna, gonna watch it live on stream. Just gonna, quick, it on? just gonna quickly watch this. If you guys could be quiet for a sec, so everyone could at least hear it. So this, this was Zach's uh, response to my uh, executive decision that I made today. You blew it! 
Okay, then. Thank you. Thank you, Billy Madison. Appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're welcome. And now this entire stream can no longer be monetized. That's right. Yeah! Because of that half a second clip of... Yeah, that's great. <laughs> oh, yeah, Sean, you got to fill everybody in on the nightmare that you had. On what? The nightmare with the s The nightmare with all the... Oh, fuck. Okay, well, see, the problem is... The problem is, with, you're talking about all the copyright flags. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I've had to uh, go back and censor and re-render and re-upload several of the live stream archives because uh, I'm doing like literally months worth of live stream archives in advance. That's why I haven't been doing much else this week. I've kind of been focusing on that. Um, so the problem was a lot of the to videos. Keep me happy. Oh, yes, yeah, just to keep Zach happy. The one person who relies on them every week in the entire world. Um, I listen, I watch them intermittently, but yeah, yes. I do watch them. <laughs> There's some pretty funny ones. I, I, yeah, I watch bits and pieces of them as I'm editing them. But usually what I do is I'll skim through and I'll see if we watched any YouTube videos or whatever. And usually I'll cut them out unless I think they're ones that won't really be a problem or that'll be okay because we were doing reactions to everything or whatever. So sometimes I'll leave them in. Most of the time I cut them out. Um, so yeah, there was one. It was like literally... The, the, okay, it was like a two and a half hour long... SNI, uh, and that was only half of it. <laughs> the whole thing was actually five hours. I split it into two two and a half hour parts. Yep. Um, so one of them, there was one minute that featured a short song by Tabuscus, and uh, anyway. now normally when there's a song and it gets flagged, they initiate revenue sharing. But not Tabuscus. No, Tabuscus was like, oh, that's my song, I'm taking all the money. Well, he's but, a bad person, what do you expect? And I'm like, wait a minute, you, your song is in it for precisely one of 150 minutes. No, you're not taking all the money. So I went back and I re-rendered, I cut out that one minute and re-rendered the whole fucking two hours and 29 minutes remaining and re-uploaded it just to... Uh, you fuck know, get around that that bullshit. Fuck him up his fucking ass. So now when you watch it, you'll just hear the, a couple of just random references to Debuscus out of nowhere for no reason. Uh, well, that's more or less where the song was cut out of. Uh, I would have just put a little slate here. This you could have heard this, but Debuscus is a cunt. And then that would have been the whole slate. Then there was another one where, uh, and I had a feeling this one might get get. Well, it would almost definitely get flagged. I didn't expect it to get flagged as hard as it did, though. Like, it was borderline copyright strike. Like, I was, I thought for sure I was going to get a strike for it, but I didn't. Um, so what ended up happening was, uh, th this was, you know, 2013, Doctor Who's 50th anniversary, so needless to say, talking about Who a lot. And um, one of the things we did was we watched the uh, comic relief special starring Rowan Atkinson. Uh, where he's the doctor, and it's just, you know, big, very tongue-in-cheek and stuff like that. Um, so we watched it so much fun, and reacted to it, and it was fun. So I, I thought, you know what, fuck it, I'm going to leave it in. And, you know, if they want to do revenue sharing or whatever, no, that's fine, whatever. It's worth it just because, you know, we had some good reactions, a lot of laughing and stuff, and we had a good time. Uh, yeah. so, I, so I put it up. Not only does it get flagged, like, immediately, but it gets blocked worldwide so literally nobody in the entire world can watch it <laughs> like i have never had anything flagged that hard before like i was like holy shit only i can watch it now <laughs> so, i will say if they fucking flag you for i broke star trek yeah i will lose my fucking mind oh that is amazing no i'm gonna definitely try to leave that one in uh because that was that oh my in. god we cut it just, out of the clip and put it up privately. Using all of us screen. just died watching that. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm own. pretty sure that one will be okay because that's just kind of you know a couple guys doing a funny YouTube video, and I'm sure they won't care too much. But uh, and I always credit the ones that I put in there anyway, and, and link back to the originals. But um, uh, yeah. So anyway, so I had to cut that out obviously and repost that. And there's been a couple of other small ones. There's a few. So basically, my, my take on it is I'll, I'll put it up. I'll see if see how it gets flagged, and if it's not too severe, I'll leave it. And if it is, then I'll go back and censor it. Course, Meanwhile, me, oh, of course, it means I'm blowing up my data cap for this week uh, or for this month. I get a terabyte of data every month, and I'm already at like 970 gigs. 
And it doesn't tick, it doesn't tick over again until the fifteenth. <laughs> so I'll definitely be going over this month. There's no question about that. I was just thinking um, it'd be funny uh, with the things you had to out. I mean, it's just like an instant jump cut, just like I was like, three, two, one, click. That, oh, that was hilarious. That's pretty, <laughs> that's pretty much what it is, actually. <laughs> so I, I three, this, two, one, and there you go. Wasn't that great? Every single one of my comic book reviews. Got flagged. For what? Copyright. Every single one of them. That's and bullshit. All I'm doing is holding up a comic book like this. Yeah, like just the cover. Yeah, and it's the my, the, the classic one. It's like fucking dwell. It's, it's like a journey into darkness or whatever. Dweller in darkness, like fifteen from like nineteen seventy five. Who gives a shit? Why? Why are we flagging? Who the fuck? This? Who the fuck is flagging it? Uh, uh, I don't know. I didn't look into it. Uh, you should you should check. Oh, it's being it. flagged for inappropriate content for. Oh, that's what it. Oh, right. It's not, saying, it's not like copyright. It's inappropriate content. What? I'm like, why? Because it's a comic. Like maybe I cussed during it, but like literally every uh, video on my channel I cuss because it's ridiculous. I like flowery language. Yeah. And Fuck I know yeah. Like single language. You can just use non-cuss words. Like yeah, I could. But that's right. not as fun. I choose not to. But I saw like, a video like and that. apparently. This thing now is uh, speed running this kids game oh, yeah. to try and see how quickly you can get banned from like huh. moment of creating an account to clicking the confirmation email and everything to going in the game and getting banned. So, <laughs> and this guy did it in like a minute and forty. It was some, it's some Disney game or something. Okay. <laughs> and this guy did it in like okay. a minute and forty one seconds. Like he literally started the clock, put in all his info on the sign up sheet and his email and like that. Yeah. Don't log in stuff. So, then went in the game and typed fuck. Got a warning, typed fuck, got kicked out. Damn <laughs> <laughs> you, uh, so, It's like, man. fuck, you should my, use that word. Fuck, my you. Only theory is that it's because it's comic books and they're it's marked for, like, kids. But guess what? Oh. Kids are all ages. Uh, not necessarily See, that, kids. See, that that, that's the problem with that system, is it's very unclear as to what the yep. problem was. Yeah, it doesn't tell me. You know, and at least with the... Uh, you know, with the copyright flags, it tells you yeah, exactly, exactly yeah, what it was. Yeah, it's like, tell me a time stamp. this is the company, go. this is the timestamp of the content in question, and there you go. Damn so. music. Hell, I can just hit the mute button. <sighs> Bam, mutes it for me right there. But I can mute just the section, too, now. Yeah. Great. Z- Zach, that's starting to get really creepy. <laughs> 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 I thought that was Ryan's screen at first. Uh-huh. <laughs> it's Hi, Dunstan Ryan. checks in. Hey. I just snuck in. The back door? <laughs> That's what she said. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> snuck in went. the back door. Wasn't me. I just had to check on my wife. I think I felt his foot like trying to stick out through her stomach. Why did oh, you try to stick your foot through her stomach? I thought he's nice. Not, not me, yeah. <laughs> it's so weird. That's not very nice. Why would you do that to your wife? You should watch your language, star. <laughs> High five percent through the stomach, bam! Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> it's so exciting! No. I'm so excited for you, Quack. I didn't realize it was so close. Yeah, it's... A week from today's review date. Holy shit, really? That's amazing. Oh, you're gonna be a dad! Quack Jr. on the way. So much time had passed. Like, from little, when you announced Quack. It's like so much time had passed from when you announced it. Like, it seemed like you just announced that. But what it is, you know what's funny is, I, I'm pretty sure, Cass, you were on this coast when he announced it. And then you yeah. left. And he came back, and now he's here. You're like, oh, alright. Took, took a vacation and came back. Yeah. Uh, that would be possible, then Quack's wife would have been pregnant for 15 months now. Oh, I, I don't know, I, hey, look. But no, I think you are right that I was here, I think, because you announced the, what, every round September, Quack? Like, Until recently, every okay. day was exactly the same. So okay, I mean, Joe's yeah. wife. Yeah, because I seem to recall, like, it was when I just moved in here, and I was on my bed on my laptop when I heard it. And I just randomly remember that, but... I'm pretty sure I wasn't still in Ontario when I heard that, because that would have been the summer. Worst cut, worst case in Ontario. Yeah, I'm, I'm, ha- I'm happy. Very much is. Work. We gotta get Thank back you, to that, damn it. Yeah. Hey, Chris, how's it going? Yeah, that's awesome. You enjoying your Switch? I am, yes. I'm enjoying <laughs> my Wii U. I have that, too. 
I'm, I'm enjoying my wee wee. We should be friends. <laughs> 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 Bless, Bless you. you. <laughs> hey, Ryan. Bless you. Yo. Uh, this is for you. Bless you. Oh, hell yeah. Bless you. <laughs> Bless <love> you. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. That's not the right one. You're... There you go. Bless you. Stop saying bless you. <laughs> <laughs> He's muted himself, and you're just going, Bless you. I know what's going on. Bless you. Oh my gosh. No, we'll do this later. We'll do this later. Close it! There we go. Okay. I will close nothing. <laughs> I'm riding a horse in Zelda. You sure the horse isn't Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. <laughs> yeah, Ooh, it tastes just like a raisin. You like blew my fucking face off just then. Oh. oh. Uh, oh. <laughs> I just... There yeah. There are things to talk about this week. A lot of them. There are indeed. Like movies, video games. There is... Uh, video games. There's some... Uh, some good trailers came out this week. Yeah. Uh, oh, wait, no, I didn't see the end of them. Only one mattered. We had the uh, the first full official proper actual trailer for Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two, which was awesome. Yep. And we got a uh, pretty big character reveal at the end of that. Yeah, uh, but what about yeah. Deadpool Two? No, it's Jesus Christ. No. It's called leading up to things. <laughs> <laughs> We also had the first full proper Alien Covenant trailer, oh, which so, I can't wait. which looks Love amazing. Which, which, I, which I just saw in IMAX today, by the way. Oh, oh nice. <laughs> I think they put too much in the trailer, but that's just me. That's what a lot of people have been saying, yeah. No, unlike the original Alien trailers, which were very, uh, you know... No, no context at all. It was just a lot of scary shit happening, and you had no idea what was going on. You just knew you had to see that movie. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm, I'm refusing to watch any more marketing for Alien Covenant. I just want to watch it in the fucking. Uh, I did see the motion cap still. The guy who plays the motion cap, the alien on top of the not so much uh, background the, noise. The ship. The one yeah. in, in the trailer, he's like shit. That, they, they, they like guess released photos. Of people complaining about the CGI. Oh, so, but it's full motion cap. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. I guess it's partial suit too. Yeah. So, you know, whatever. I'm excited, bro. though. I'm Take really your excited. Take complaints and stuff, basically. Cool. Great stuff. I'll put it this way. The Momo <laughs> in the theater who wouldn't shut the fuck up during the entirety of Logan <laughs> just kept describing literally everything that was okay, happening Joey, yes. in the theater. Oh. Uh, they're having in the movie. Their chair? Oh, um, look, he's walking over there. Oh, look, he popped out his claws. Oh, look, oh, he's stabbing that now. guy. Yeah, she's dead. Oh my, oh my god. god, shut up! <laughs> <laughs> so, the old man in Man of well, Steel where he goes, that's Kevin Costner. Oh, no! <laughs> uh, while the trailers are playing, while, at, while Alien, at, at the end of the Alien Covenant trailer, he says, that'll do. Like, that'll well, do. If you're one of those people that oh, fucking made like, Prometheus, right? And you're just sitting there like, yeah, now there's an alien in it. Good. I fucking but love Prometheus. Prometheus oh, is an alien. Yeah. It was an alien movie. I think I've, think oh, I've like watched the solid. making of Prometheus as many yeah. times as I've seen Prometheus at this oh, point. Only is stupid like people hours? didn't like Prometheus. Four and a half hours. Yeah. And I've watched okay. it like five times. Only stupid I'm, people didn't I'm, like Prometheus. Okay. I'm going to lose so many points by making this, but I've yet to see Prometheus. Get the fuck out of here! I haven't seen the alien. Now, Stout, uh, so you had that experience with Logan, which is what you know, two two and a half hour movie thereabouts. Yes, yeah. Yes, yeah. Try yes. try having that experience with a group of Momos for Lord of the Fucking Rings. Oh. <laughs> I really shouldn't overuse that term. Oh. Fellowship of I'll use whatever fucking term I want. You porch monkey. So. <laughs> it's okay, he's taking it back. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> if I um, ever run for public office, this is the one live stream that's going to be pulled. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. 
He right. said he, he says voted in. he just walked right up to those porch monkeys and grabbed them by the pussy. <laughs> Uh, Lord. <laughs> Donald Trump's America, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Um, yes, yeah, it's fel- Fellowship of the Ring, and there was like three of them that just would not shut up. So it's let like when... One of the, let me guess one of the comments. Uh, dildo faggins. Well, kind of. Uh, I was just going to say, actually, because when he meets up with Bilbo, he's like, Bilbo's like, what do you say, dildo? <laughs> oh my god, die! Just die! <laughs> just choke on some popcorn and die right now! <laughs> I'm just picturing that just like stuck in a loop with that laugh. <laughs> Oh. It, was like, it was like Beavis and Butthead, but like when Butthead like was finally able to laugh. I never and like crap. <laughs> oh, the the no laughing episode. That's like one of my all time yeah. favorite episodes yeah. where they just yeah. like <laughs> they just can't stop. <laughs> yeah, and it's like it's just been building up. <laughs> it's like sweat pouring off them. <laughs> We're gonna talk about venereal disease. <laughs> And talk well, about the penis about and the vagina. <laughs> <laughs> I love how he's like right in their faces mm-hmm. saying it too. <laughs> I love the animation. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's like right up in their face. Yeah. But um, yeah, I, ne- I never wanted to to just murder talk people so penis. much as talk by the time the I got to the end of Fellowship of the Ring. Ugh. <sighs> God, thank God for home video. Old people are worse than teens, based on my experience. Yeah. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? What's that mean? Who's that guy? That's the guy from the beginning. Oh, worse. That's Kevin Costner. What? I can't hear you, Kevin Costner. Isn't that Nicolas Cage? No, that's Liam Neeson. <laughs> you're, you're in, you're in the Harry Potter movie, and one of them goes, I, "I thought that wizard was from the other one." And I'm like, "A different wizard." <laughs> like, yeah, dog, it's Dumbledore. <laughs> this the same movie? Are you my son? Where <laughs> 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 are the hobbits? <laughs> uh, that happened. That happened. she been by. Today, this negative. today had the obligatory old lady who had no signal on her TV. I was watching a movie and I can't get the cable back. It's like, so were you watching like on demand or? No, I was watching a movie. So, <laughs> so like a DVD? Yeah, I watched a DVD. Okay, so p- pick up your cable remote. Okay, I've got it. And look for the input button. Input. Uh, it says play. Uh, open, close. Uh, okay, that's your DVD remote. Pick up the cable remote. Oh, you want the cable remote? Yes. Like I said the first time. <laughs> now press the input button. I don't see an input button. Okay, read off the buttons that you see there. Okay, power, input, number, input! Wait, you just said it! You were just looking at it! (laughs) Push that button that you just said you saw. What button? Input! I don't see that here. Oh my fucking god! (laughs) Every day, there's at least three of them. (laughs) It's like, it's like... Like the, it's a, we finally, you finally get them to push the goddamn input button. It's like, okay, now what happened on the TV? Nothing. <laughs> You're lying. <laughs> push it again. Okay, push it and hold it. No, no, just push it and let it go. Like, you actually have to tell it? people press and release <laughs> the button. And it's like, okay, there's a whole bunch of things. What do I do? Just keep pushing and releasing the button until you get to the one you want. Say, okay, so the arrow keys? No, don't touch the arrow keys. They don't do anything. It won't scroll through the goddamn menu. It's your cable remote, not your TV remote. (laughs) So push the button. What button? Ugh. 
Push and release, so they're just like mashing the, the same button. button. <laughs> well, you're just picturing it going through the menu like. <laughs> Still says no signal. <laughs> You do like my grandpa does. He, he, he's going to channel 239 from 116. So uh-huh. instead of pressing the numbers, 239, he just goes... <laughs> he's holding the channel oh, button down. Oh my god, really? Mm. Uh, I mean, I say that having done it myself many times. Uh-oh. But really? I think we broke cast. <laughs> Keep it together, keep it. Said so many things, I don't know which part he's laughing at now. I'll do like a good 50. I'll, I'll push up, down, up, down. Too many, man. Too many. Oh, God. Hey, <laughs> breathe. I'm just laughing at everybody else's. <laughs> you just want to belong. Yeah. What? What? <laughs> What? <laughs> People could die. <laughs> oh God! Like that line from <laughs> Did someone say poop? Is that I, I thought you know. said something about an octopus. I didn't quite of, catch it. I just have a mental Im- image of Zach's grandpa. <laughs> 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 oh, God, Cass. Oh, no, we lost it again. Shit. Oh, wait, hold on. Does he have it? He might have his composure. He might be good. Oh, he's got some breathing. And then he's calmly, his rationally explain what was so gut-bustingly funny. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right, Cass, okay. explain. Calmly. I was <laughs> 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 He was picturing something. <laughs> picturing. Next word. It's like something you said, but the. Oh, oh my god! Oh, that, 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 that really thing I said! I can't read what the options are. <laughs> 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 What button? You told me to press it. I'm pressing it. I love that voice that you do. What button? <laughs> the, the, the abrasive, clueless old person. Uh, says no signal on the TV. Tired of you fucking cable people ripping me off. <laughs> I, used to, I used to work at a retirement community and like that's how a lot of those old ladies sound. Like Sharpie's <laughs> always gonna get his kicks by going into people's houses and just removing the input button. Yeah, that's right. You're not qualified to use this. Sure, now you don't have one. <laughs> well I want it work. I don't see oh. an input button. And then there literally won't be one. There you go. <laughs> She just labeled the button, this one. Come, come to find out the lady was blind anyways. <laughs> and Jeff. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I can't see what channel is on. Oh, shit. It's like, it's like terrible. It's like the right old lady trying to enter home with the knife. It's like Mrs. Magoo. Ah. No, she's not that she's blind. She just can't see more than an inch away from her. So Mrs. Magoo style. See, what's great. The- Sorry, go ahead, Seth. It's like I love that that Zach used a knife as a play phone. <laughs> he holds a knife up his phone. He's, wow. he's just that wow. hardcore. That's not America. I don't know what it is. My grandpa hit fucking one time the phone was ringing. He thinks it's a goddamn right? look, look, Yeah. Damn. Look, Zach is from good old boy Southern stock. He's got to have a knife at hand. It can be used for a lot of goddamn things. That's I right. got one too. There you go. All good. 
I got a bigger uh, one that says it's on my daily <clears throat> carry. A fucking huge goddamn knife. Awesome. It's like, a, it's like the computer. Saying. It's like the computer tech support <laughs> team from <laughs> the IT crowd too, where where somebody just can't get it, and <laughs> they they ask two things. It's like, have you tried turning it on? Turn, turning it off and, and then, on again. <laughs> turning it off and on again. Yeah. And then the other part goes, I'm sorry, you're from the past. <laughs> That's right, yeah. Is it plugged in? Uh, no, I was going to say, like, the thing Brandon was saying about how, like, not necessarily blind, but just can't see more than, like, a certain thing. Mm -hmm. It reminds me of I was riding with somebody who was driving a, a Buick Sentry. It was, like, a rental car. And I looked over the dash, and I was like, you can really tell that this car is designed for old people, because, like, the size of the digits on the speedometer were just, they were huge. I was looking at the speedometer, it's like, 20, 40, 60, 80, it's like, <clears throat> And after 40, it just says, stop! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> too low, yeah. Yeah. So, okay. Um, yeah, so... <laughs> What were we talking about again? I don't know. Oh, trailers, right. Oh, and uh, so so there's, of course, the Deadpool 2 teaser, which everybody, I think, saw. Um, that just, like, uh, God damn it, just you couldn't not spoil that, could you? God no. <laughs> nope. He had to be the one. But, That's uh, why you go to the fucking theater, by the way, to now, see Logan. Now, we all probably like saw one of the numerous leaked versions the day it premiered. Uh, and then on... I don't know if it's official or not, but there's a YouTube channel called Ryan Reynolds. I think it is official, actually, uh, that posted the actual trailer, like, properly, uh, like, the next day. So that was the one that I linked to on. I, guess uh, I should finally see the first one on Facebook. Yes, yes, Ryan, you should get on that. It's hilarious. You'll have a great time. Yes, well, it's good, Ryan good fun. sees that more while I see the media. There you there go. You know. See, you get you both have your missions, but yes. uh, but yeah, I mean, it, I mean, there's basically no spoilers at all in it. It's just a minute and a half of Deadpool being Deadpool, and it's freaking hilarious. Like just absolutely hilarious. So, definitely oh God! Won't somebody please? <laughs> <laughs> All right, go watch it if you haven't, because we're going to talk about it now. Okay, good. I just love how he's like, "Not on my watch." He goes, and then like a full minute of the minute and a half trailer is him like struggling in the phone booth trying to get changed. His butt like pressed up against the glass, can't get his arm in the thing. <laughs> Meanwhile, you hear the guy just screaming and screaming in the background. <laughs> and, then he, and, then he, and then he's like, and he's, after the guy's dead, and, and he's laying there with him and eating his ice cream, he, he goes, he goes, I think we're missing the larger point here. What the fuck was the focus? <laughs> 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 That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, uh, good, good stuff. Good times. I have no idea when that's coming out, but obviously they're working on it. But uh, yeah, looking like, forward to it. Well, the the trailer itself says it like. Oh, that, oh, did it? Uh, I thought it said no, like coming no, it sometime, it just, eventually or something. I think it said coming soon. soon. Yeah. On your face. No, it's just <laughs> all of you. Yeah. Not soon enough. Oh right, right, right. That's what coming. It is. Not soon enough. Not <laughs> soon enough. Okay. Uh, so pickups. We got a lot of people in the room. We should probably do pickups. I'm just gonna quickly refresh uh, the room here. It's kind of glitching out on me. I'll Before just be... we do pickups, I just want to say, Logan was fucking amazing. That is yes. how you do Wolverine. That is yeah. how you fucking do Wolverine. Awesome. He's still too tall. That's, right. That's how you do it. Brutal, right. violent, yeah. fucking awesome homage to fucking westerns and yes. Terminator 2 and, and I love every fucking second of that movie. And awesome. And X, oh. and X freaking 23 was perfect as well. Sweet. That, that was amazing. Uh, I'm just going to quickly refresh here uh, and then uh, we'll be right back so uh, just hang tight everybody. Part 2 Ah! This is driving me crazy. Hold on. <clears throat> but the where could I be? He's like, 
Wait, All right. Yeah. I'm back. Uh, we're here. We're back, Jack. Yeah, we're back. Holy back, shit. Kitty. It's apparently, uh, I actually got a proper error message this time. Apparently, it's something to do with the Microsoft Visual Basic 2015 runtime library. So Ooh. I think, oh, lovely. think I need to do some reinstalling of some stuff. Because it's been doing that a lot lately, and it's really pissing me off. Yeah, kitty, kitty. It's better. Oh. It's better to be pissed off than yeah, pissed kitty. on. So yet another like recording that. of SNI <laughs> that I shall have to um, reconvert before it will be ready for YouTube. It's wonderful. Thanks. You have fun with that. I'm so glad you're making more work for me, you stupid fucking glitch. So, pickups. Pickups, 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 pickups. pickups. Oh, yeah. Uh, awesome music. Yeah. I have eight. I finally counted while we were you got at that. Eight. Time. Awesome. Six. 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 I have two. What? I have, I have one that's div that could get divided three ways. So I have one. Awesome. So what was that? Quack. I got like five or six. I think. Okay. Six. Raz. Anything? Two. two. Stout has ninety-three. Uh, <laughs> and. Uh, garbage gamer. I have fourteen. Fort mm. holy shit. And aficionados actually, Chris. Actually I got two. I Sixteen. Forgot. Sixteen. Wow. Alright. Sorry, who has two? I do. Right. Right. Uh, I have one sort of. One sort of. Okay. Well that's... I'm gonna be a garbage <laughs> can. Yeah. Well I picked something up this week, it's computer related. Okay then. All right, well, let's, I'll just go down the line here. We'll start with uh, Zachariah Smith. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. I got a just... knockoff fidget cube, and I've been playing with it. Awesome. You Wait. piece of shit. You Wait. sporting that bootleg crap. The dollar I store really ones are truly ones. the best. The finest quality. <laughs> oh, you have one? I have a real one. I got kickstarted this shit, you kidding me? I'm buying like three more because I know I'm going to lose one. I want to put one in my pants so I know yeah, I get, I get one. one. But really they fast. look exactly the same and no, completely it doesn't actually... equal in functionality uh, entirely. No, actually, the thumbsticks are different. Uh, these, the All these buttons are completely different. See, on his, they're all the same button. On this, this is five different text tactile buttons. Oh, I see. So that's different. Uh huh. This, you get two different buttons. This, it's like you get a different feel, like if you spin it in a different direction, mm -hmm. which you don't on that one. There, you get things when you when you buy, pay with the extra $10 for this one. Yeah, from so Ancy, it's only 22 bucks from like Ancy Lads. So Zax is a piece of shit. No, Zax <laughs> is cheap. Cool. I like cheap. It's not good. It's, he's going to break his probably soonish, I'd imagine. Uh -huh. Yeah, especially as much as he fidgets. <laughs> You're just jealous. So jealous. Hashtag Dunstan Wars. Uh, it's not made with <laughs> durable materials is the problem. I mean, that's why they're cheaper. They're just made with cheaper mm -hmm. materials. You know. Cool. Okay, next up is I'm going to look for them at the yeah, dollar store. Yeah, I love that fucking movie. Slaughterhouse. And nice. Look, look at the effort that they put on the reversible cover. Wow, it's so different. <laughs> why bother? <Yeah. laughs> oh, the title's in a different location. I see. Yeah, yeah. basically. Wow. It's like, that well, sounds... you could have saved yourself some... I'm going to be double dipping on that, even though it's basically Man. the exact disc that I already have. Man, that glare awesome. looks so real. Even though the disc I was reading free, too. Hey, Dr. Unusual. <laughs> Dr. Strange, and I got the uh, lenticular behind the freaking thing to make it more creative. Yeah. Creative part for the freaking clear thing. There you cool. go. Very nice. I like the freaking clear <laughs> thing. Nice. Yeah, the that's, Neopack. that's the one you want, Justin. Oh, the sweet. Neopack version also oh. has both cuts. I did not know that know such a thing looks. existed. I just have the director's cut in the key that's case with the big film. fucking book that comes with it. Rodney Dangerfield in a surprisingly comedically dark book. Uh, unforgivable. Awesome. I've got Unforgiven on, on the digital book too. Never seen it. It's a hell of a thing, killing a man. Ah, uh, with a nick they on. They big lost it. Yeah. Uh, that's okay, oh, though. I hate when they... Still and nice. finally, oh, bastards. because it went super cheap this week. Uh-huh. Oh, oh Trilogia de Guillermo del Toro. I just need Payne's Labyrinth. Nice. <laughs> Guillermo del Toro. Andale! 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 Andale!
watching me forever until I get one because I'm poor as I, shit. I really want the Criterion of Pan's Labyrinth. Avoid I only all, bought one thing this week, actually. Avoid all other editions. They are all crap. Everything else is gifts or prizes. Sean, all right. you, still have the, Sean you still have the full screen DVD. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> With monoroll <Cool>. sound. <laughs> With, with interactive menus and <laughs> and subtitles. color picture. Oh, the subtitle God. is considered a special Multiple feature. Multiple subtitle uh, tracks and audio options. That's actually a, a special feature. Audio options. Like interactive menu. Scene selection. scene selection. I love man. that special yep. feature. Bios and filmography is something like that. Biography, yep. Uh, this one has oh that. Oh my yep. gosh. <laughs> and of course, of course those filmographies those. always end in 1997. Like, I know. Yes. <laughs> Even the ones yeah. that are released later, they just never yeah. updated them. They're just like, fuck it. <laughs> Like George Clooney's last movie was Batman and Robin. <laughs> yeah, that was, <laughs> like, that was it. His career Batman ended right there. Two thousand four. Batman and Robin. That's the last thing, really. Yeah. That's it. He hasn't done a movie an since. Awkward freeze frame. Like the Amer- <laughs> you're on the Blu-ray of the American. You're flipping over. Like really, it ends in two thousand whatever. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ryan. What'd you get? All right. Well. The first thing I got from, uh, for the, those of you guys, you guys know Cinema Sickness. He has like his yes. online uh, mm-hmm. store, like on Instagram. Yes. I've bought stuff from him from time to time. Well, this I bought because this special, when I first watched, I've always been a movie person, but this special, my mom made me watch this when I was like 10 my years old. My mom made me watch it. Sorry. <laughs> and because of that, I we recorded it on VHS tape. And I rewatched it and rewatched it. And it's what got me to watch all these classic movies. And it's the right. AFI's 100 Years, 100 Movies VHS set. Holy oh, shit. And and wow. It's factory, it's factory sealed. That's pretty awesome. Very and nice. It's, very nice. It's the exact special that I saw back then. I remember. And that oh. was when I was introduced to, like, Citizen Kane, Bridge of the River Kwai, all these classics. I just went down the list as a but, kid. And but that's all. in beautiful SP VHS yeah. with oh, wow. high fidelity nice. sound. And I'm that's much quality. better than your recording you watched yeah, as a kid. Yeah, the special features on this include a 1998 copyright date. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, but I'm gonna keep it factory sealed for right now, just because you can watch it like on YouTube, and there's no yeah. point it's open. If, yeah. Um, but anyways, I was really happy to get this, especially only awesome. four dollars. Yeah. Plus, you never uh, know. That might get a DV- like a bonus feature somewhere down the line. Yeah, I think they got a DVD of it, but it went out of print so quick, and it's like outrageous. So you might um, might stumble across it one day too. You never know. Yeah. See so that, got that, and then of course. So I was just going to interject for a second here. That, that's always been interesting to me is is items like that, like some oh, yeah. just obscure thing from your past or your youth that had such a huge influence on you, and someone else might look at it, it's like, what's some stupid special from twenty years ago? Who cares? But for you, it's like, ah! you know. And I, I like I find that fascinating. Like everybody has one of those things or a few of those things. Uh, that will be. I actually have a me. Story. I, I've been looking for something based on this whole thing. Okay, yeah. when I was staying with my grandma in Lubbock, Texas, she had Showtime, and I saw the special about the history of like s- explicit sex in film or whatever. Hmm. Like really explicit stuff. Like like they talk about not like porn, but you know the the, the soft core like NC seventeen stuff, right? Yeah. And that's where I got introduced to a lot of like um um uh what's his name? Just Franco and and like those oh, kind okay. of films. Like and Russ, so that's Russ like Myers I, that's and how John I, I, Waters and stuff like that. Yeah, 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 right. And, but I, I've been wanting to find this documentary. And I cannot fucking find <clears> it. <throat> I can't figure it out. I don't know what it's called. Oh. It, it's just it's it's somewhere in the mid '90s, early yeah. mid '90s. It's when it came out in a Showtime. That's all I know. See, there's, <laughs> a, there's one of like a big compilation made just for me of classic <laughs> previews from Disney VHS. To Ah yes, <laughs> the old school. It was ones. always tradition. You don't fast forward to the fucking previews on the goddamn Disney tape. Yes. <laughs> Mine would be the actual documentary that that the film A League of Their Own came from. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. that's cool. See, there was there was <laughs> um, a few for me as a kid. Uh, my mom often taped stuff like that off of pay TV. This is when pay TV was fairly new in Canada. They had First Choice and they had Super Channel. Uh, which later merged to become First Choice Super Channel, uh, and then it 
just became <laughs> Super Channel after a while. He ditched the first choice part. But anyway, um, when she first got it, it was also around the first time we had our first VCR. So she was just recording stuff like crazy. So she would obviously record lots of movies, but also uh, a lot of documentaries and stuff that she thought I would find interesting. So I remember there was a few like, uh, like It Came From Hollywood, which was actually hosted by John Candy and had a lot of other SCTV alumnus in it as well. Uh, there was The Horror of It All, which was a um, uh, basically just a documentary about the history of horror, uh, narrated by John Carradine, which was very cool. Uh, and then there were some other ones as well, I don't recall. But, uh, but a, lo a lot along those lines that sort of were, in, in a similar fashion, were kind of my inroads to those types of films and that, that history. It's great stuff. It's just crazy. Like I never thought I would come across this because I mean, it was it was just a special, and like literally, I don't know like how my movie loving would have evolved if I hadn't watched this. Like that's how. Yeah. It's this. Was, yeah. Could have been watching a hundred Jack and Jill. I, I, think, I think the same for me, man. I think well, the same for me. Because yeah. the the great thing Where, about I went wrong so long ago. The great thing about documentaries like that is they give you just such a nice encapsulated overview of yeah. you know this either this type of film or just you know film in general and and i think in, in sort of giving you little tastes of like hey this is this is the good stuff it yeah it really helps to whet your appetite um in, in that respect it was the same thing uh like for me with those those documentaries that i saw like about classic horror movies was i've talked about this before how as a kid i had some books and stuff that had stuff with about the universal monsters and whatnot i didn't care that they were black and white or or whatever i just wanted to see them because they looked like cool monsters and then yeah. seeing these these horror documentaries as well just kind of cemented that. It's like, oh, wow, that looks awesome. You know, it's really wanted to check it out. And, um, yeah, good stuff. But anyway. like, you know, <laughs> my mom was, like, the big film person. And she had all, like, the film books. So it was, like, her making me watch a special. And then back, like, in elementary school, mm. everybody was like, hey, man, my dad has a stack of Playboys at my house. And, and at my house. And I was like, dude, but my mom has – Hollywood Babylon, the book at my house. Oh, my like, mom has that book too. Yeah. And I was like, that is, you know, I was like, yeah. I'm jealous of the people who had like a family member that got you into film. I had to do it myself. Oh. Yeah. So, pickups. I mean, yeah. 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 So, I'm sorry. Ryan, we're getting more. We're getting. We're getting we're, uh, Stoud's getting bored with all of our personal stuff. <laughs> we're going Stoud, to Stoud, Stoud's Stoud. getting bored with us discussing our love of film because Stout actually exactly. hates film. So, okay. Give me a Joey Diaz. Zach, come on. <laughs> well, who was it who was saying that Roman. we need to get started on pickups so that the, it doesn't take too long? The Before the Trilogy. Oh, I need to see that whole trilogy still. The Before nice. Trilogy. Nice. Excellent. I, yeah. I actually have great movies. I pre-ordered this as soon as they announced it. And the thing is, when I pre-ordered it, Amazon had it listed for $39. Oh, so wow. me and Luke uh, made sure we bought our copies. And then, like, within a week, or no, within, like, three days, it had jacked up to 100 Oh, so wow. So for a brief period of time, it was for $39. And that's I'm not paying 100 bucks for that. Sorry. Nice. I, and, I had um, never even heard about it until you and Luke started posting pictures of it on your bucks. Facebook page. Who's this pages. Richard Linklater guy? <laughs> like, you 60 whole American dollars for it. Like, that's the most you're going to get for that. Yeah. Um, so I'm, I think I would pay 100 bucks for this, but that's because I love the movies. I've never seen them, though. It's blind uh, buying. Yeah, yeah, I know that. Yeah. Yeah, I I'll like, get it during the sale, basically. The second oh. one's the best, in my spend opinion. This, I'll spend 100 yeah. bucks, but I'll get two. It's 65 right now. And they just oh, have beautiful. Okay. They have these beautiful covers oh Ooh, those are really nice. nice yeah so anyways the next yeah, the next everyone the last... has been telling me about that the whole thing. cool i might have to check that out last but certainly not not least <clears throat> i gotta get up for this one i got a tattoo right on my left butt cheek hold on all right here we go all right was that was that everything that's everything all right oh, cool that's everything yeah. Are you no, sure? If you're going down the line, you kind of skipped over me. So no, I, not on my line. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah it's down. Stream. It's down my line, and it, if you, yeah, yeah, if you look at the live stream, you'll see the order. He can't. He's on his phone. Oh, never yeah. mind. But you're you're uh, third, tablet, legitimately. Whatever. Don't worry. I wouldn't skip over you, buddy. All right, it's your turn. No, speaking just, speaking of which, it's actually your turn. <laughs> it, it is actually your turn now. Okay. Raz. Yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> Um, because you is your far right one always, just so you know. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, 
So, I meant to send Sean the pictures so that my pictures would actually show up since I can never ah. do anything, but I forgot. Oh. So, I'll start that next week. All right. But, but unless you guys want to go back to a cram, but it would take forever. But no. I, uh, the Doctor <laughs> Strange deal book. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Nice. Yes. This is just gorgeous. I think you did show some pictures of that on uh, Facebook, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. But, and uh... then, also, bec literally because I'm a superhero completist for no other reason, <laughs> uh -huh. and it was the cheapest other thing there while I was at Best Buy, I got the Suicide Squad and Cindy Oh, there you go. Yeah, I just picked that one up recently, too. I still haven't watched it, though. Not in a huge rush. I just wanted to get it while it was relatively cheap. <laughs> I wish I could have gotten the steelbook. I'm bummed. Actually, I, 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 I gotta watch. I gotta watch Batman versus Superman first. Then I'll watch Suicide Squad. I'll be able to do a double bill of the two Mar DC movies everybody hated. <laughs> I like Batman versus Superman. I yeah. and Suicide Squad was okay. I didn't yeah. well, the, thing, the thing uh, is, with Batman versus Superman, like I've said, you've got to watch the extended. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, that's the one I'm definitely gonna watch. There's no question that will that's be my. I I, to be fair, I have only watched the extended cut because why the hell would you watch anything else? Yeah, yeah. I love both. I love the actual cuts, so Zach I will. Snyder movies. I love cuts. both cuts. Zach, you, you can shut up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, is, yeah, sorry, yeah. is that was that it, Raz? Yeah, that's it. Okay. On, cool. on the subject of Raz, your pickups there. At least you picked up something that won an Academy Award. The Academy oh, Award Jesus winning Christ. movie, Suicide Squad. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, were Star Trek fans ever pissed off about that. Rightfully so. Yeah. When he yeah, yeah. saw this side by side, like, okay, here's all the characters, like every single character from Ooh. Suicide Squad, I got some. and here's all the aliens and makeup effects from Star Trek Beyond. How did this one win over this? Yeah, like, or what about a Star Wars movie, which probably had more aliens and makeup effects? Hey, than suicide yeah, movie. probably Why? because it was reflected of how meh the year was. Yeah, where it was like, oh, I guess we'll vote for this one. I you know what's messed up is um, fucking awesome. travesty. You know, um, you know Ben Mankiw with you know TCM and you know the Young Turks. He, yeah, yeah. Um, his, you know how his his grandfather is the one who wrote co-wrote the script for Citizen Kane. People kept tweeting him that night and was saying, Suicide Squad has won just as many Academy Awards as Citizen Kane. And he was just like, fuck you. <laughs> brilliant. Yeah, it was, it, was, it was amazing. What a brilliant uh, So simple and elegant. Mm -hmm. And it's the Academy's well, fault. Citizen Kane was pretty much robbed, was it not? Due to all of the the bullshit con controversy and tabloidism surrounding it, yeah. they basically it made, just buried it. Yep. It made barely any money, and uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot. To... Indicated by history. I, oh, absolutely, absolutely. I, but I and they continued. That. They continued to screw around with Orson Welles' films up until the day he died. Yeah, it's bullshit. Yeah. We're, That's we're, why every single one of his films, they have like the the. Like a different, like a bunch of different cuts. Yeah. I mean, well, at least, crazy. thank God, a touch of evil. At least they were, they were able to they recover were the footage, and mm -hmm. and do basically a reassembled. Uh, cut. There's like three different cuts of that. Um, I need to watch that, the other two. That reminds me of the scene from Ed. From what? From Ed Wood, where he's like, they wanted me to cast. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Vincent D'Onofrio as as uh, Orson Welles. Vince, Vincent <laughs> Maurice Lamarche doing the voice. Doing the voice. Yeah. I was just gonna say, yeah. Um, well, I was going to say, yeah, we'll never ever see a definitive cut of Magnificent Ambersons. Or mm -hmm. Mr. Ar Arcadian. Yeah, because the, the producers locked him out, re-edited the film, and scrapped all the scrims. So it's all yep. gone forever. And apparently, I mean, I... I mean, Hopefully burn in hell. Yeah. Forever. Philistines. I really loved it. F for fake too. I really love that one. Look, here, here's I the reason why I say I wish those people would burn in hell. Not because they they had no foresight for the future or mm -hmm. whatever, but because they were so petty. Yeah. yeah. So petty. Yeah. They destroyed someone's art and then threw away any hope. That kind of like lack of empathy pisses <clears throat> me off. Like, yeah. Those people just burn in hell. Oh, I There's know. A hell scum. I so. Absolute scum. Because that's I, just inhuman. Yeah, absolutely. I hate it. You've you have. Compromised art with your 
ham-fisted pettiness. You compromise your humanity with your pettiness. That's the problem. There you go. Yeah, I did. As much as I, I love did, the art. Yeah. I did see Logan as well, which I guess should have counted. Kind of. Well, it's not really a pickup, though. You didn't bring it home with you. <laughs> you picked up, a, you picked up a ticket. Yes. <laughs> All right. Speaking of petty ham fistery, Quack, what do you got? <laughs> uh, Infinite now, what the one? Uh, I picked up the house, picked up Doctor Strange. Yay! Um, actually, this was part of my Disney Movie Club order, which also I got Treasure oh, Island, the Blackbeard's Ghost, and the Apple Dumpling uh, Gang. Nice! I need to get right. those. Love the Apple Dumpling Gang. Uh, my eye offer order came in, which I thought I was getting scammed on. But uh -huh. I got, um... Did you actually get something legitimate from my offer? No. Oh, not. okay. No. <laughs> Don't scare me like that. Uh, salute your shorts. Okay. And then I also got the kid video. Oh, oh kid video. video. I didn't know and anybody had any episodes of that recorded. That's that's awesome. The problem is, you know. Kid sorry. video is like one of the holy grails of 80s, 80s cartoons. Like One disc of kid video, man. Yeah, yeah there, there's so the few episodes out there, like just nobody recorded it. Four discs. Four discs. Oh, four. Okay, maybe yeah. you've got them all then. Maybe I sit corrected. What do I know? And then today <laughs> I got in the mail from um, this, this uh, Disney contact I've had for a while over at uh, uh, UltimateDisney.com, which is DVDDisney.com. Ultimate Disney. Disney. Yeah, he hooked me up with um, like uh, Walt Disney treasures in the past, but I've been wanting these for a while, and I've just been dragging my feet. But I got all the, uh, the True Life Adventures. Oh, oh my god, I oh, want cool. all of those. Nice. And of course, he thought he knows I'm not into packaging anymore, so he just, I, I gotta deal with them. Oh, dude, I want, I uh, want those. Those are the ones, like, when, uh, when, we, when, me, nice. when me and the XY split, that's the one that hurt. Is that those two, like, oh, ventures were fucking mine, and she fucking took those. Uh, yeah, I was gutted, man. I got opened my blue, my, my box is like, are you fucking kidding me? She took, my, oh, she, she took the uh, World War II uh, one, which is also mine. Um, uh, the Treasures one. And the Oswald the Lucky Rabbit, because this is the shit I cared mm -hmm. about. I, don't, I like Disney stuff, but I wasn't like hardcore about the famous characters. Yeah, yeah. I like obscurities. For sure. Yeah, that's the one that really wow. hurt me. Life Adventures, though. Well, that sucks. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry to hijack your segment. No, it's okay. Oh, that's all I got. Oh, is that everything? All right, cool. That's I'm I'm super jealous of that dude. That's awesome. All right, so going down the line, right after Quack is Eric. No, it's <laughs> Stoud. You son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that fucking coming. But I know that Eric has some pretty cool stuff to show. So Kurt okay, just cool. obvious betrayal. As that's quickly right. as possible, as long as these fuckers don't interject. All right. I ain't gonna take a dump. <laughs> that ain't happening. <laughs> all right, so. I, got, I love Harvey, that movie! Oh, no, sorry. Harvey, Harvey, <laughs> Harvey, Attorney at Law, Volume 3. That completes my collection. Sweet. Harvey Corman, Attorney Birdman. at Law. Birdman. Birdman. Roger Corman, Attorney at Law, what? They got Young Ones, a really cool Leo revisionist western. Oh, that was just a young movie. gun? Clearly no, no relation ones. to the uh, early <laughs> 80s British. A nice, <laughs> like, I got post-global warming <laughs> movie. I went to, uh, so it's hot. Yes. And I found hot, this hot, for three dollars at Big Lots. The Jack fuck is that? Never heard of that one. The clock heart. It is released by Shout Factory. I've actually oh. heard of that. It apparently yeah, has really good movie. reviews. I have heard a lot of good things about it. So cool. I'll trust your bucks. opinion. Yeah. I have to check that out. Maybe. That's a three bucks, man. That's like a rental. American uh, History X, four dollars. There you go. Another movie taken away from the director. Yeah. Stuff. Awesome. And with my gift card on Amazon, I got <gasps> Big, Big Man, Man Japan. Japan. And let me tell you, none uh, of you have seen Big Man Japan. No. The last five minutes is the funniest shit I've ever seen in my life. And <laughs> laugh nice. every time. So I, will, I, saw Big Man I have Japan. to see that. That looks like a good quality film. <laughs> it's you fucking seen hilarious. Big Man Japan, Eric? You have oh, yeah. It? I saw it when it was new. I love that movie. Hilarious. <laughs> I have to check that out. Finally, with time. my gift card. Oh, Yay! On Blu-ray. Oh, you you must have been so hard when you picked that up and held it in your hand. Like I want that set. So I, I know bad. how wet you get for the bacula. I want my mind to that too. Everyone should know that the uh, first season is so short that in the first Blu-ray case you get the 
first the, you get the first season and the first part of the second season. Ah. And then in the second case, you get the last part of the second season and the first part of the third season, and so on until you get to the fifth season, where <laughs> yeah, finally balances out. <laughs> yeah, it's a little weird, but whatever. Whatever. Okay. It's all there. It's all high def. Then, it's all that matters. Today I went to half price books and I rated their twenty five cent bin. Big surprise. Yay. In Love and War, this is the Andrew Stellingway's Life. Nice. What do you you mean? Starring Rosie O'Donnell. Absent on (laughs) Blu-ray. Not yet on Blu-ray. Rosie O'Donnell, right? Oh, Chris O'Donnell. Never mind. Sorry, I wasn't trying to... Sorry, I wasn't trying to... Rosie O'Donnell. Oh, God, that's terrible. <laughs> Chris O'Donnell and Rosie O'Donnell. I love the story. <laughs> I was like, I don't remember. One minute O'Donnell. Now, this I've is. I've always felt matter. Rosie O'Donnell should do more period <laughs> drama. I want incredible special features. Paradise, man. Yes, special features. We were talking about all the incredible special features. This is the one that I picked up here for a quarter. Jody Foster. Oh, Shocked. Shocked. <laughs> it's from clearly picks. Clearly, Whoa. that's from it's early in her career. It's a gray market release. <laughs> it's a direct source special products. Inc. <laughs> developed this. Oh, oh I love that picks. company. And they do quality features work. Features include interactive menu trivia quiz. <laughs> oh, scene selector. Wait, hey. quiz? Biographies oh, yeah. and critics reviews. That's that's amazing. Or is it a quiz about trivia? I'm so confused. Is it trivia what about is a quiz? trivia? I've, I've never heard of this movie, and it has Jodie Foster and John Lithgow. So they probably they are probably both in the movie for thirty seconds, That's and like no, the really actual crazy. cast is all unknowns. Nope. Sounds like a masterpiece. It's like how they had Little Shop of Horrors nope. starring Jack Nicholson. Yeah, he's in one yeah. scene. Yeah. One Digital scene. Video disc. <laughs> Digital video disc. Digital video this disc. Was also twenty five cents. I. Don't hey, know weekend at Bernie's. I love that movie. <laughs> <laughs> weekend at Bernie's. It's a documentary. Actually, a documentary. I have no idea what it's even about. Uh, one quarter. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, but it's an MGM release, so hey. I'll probably have some of my ships. Look <laughs> 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 at Bernie. It's pretty cool, man. It's the happiest friend before he dies. Starring Joseph. Starring Joseph. I got this documentary. It's Denzel. It's like a made on demand. Oh, training day. No, it's Kevin Hart. Training day. It's Man on uh, fire. a high school senior on the verge of going pro. <laughs> Who the fuck said Jesus. Denzel? Damn porch monkey. Yeah. Somebody else said Man on fire. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> that was awesome. Silk. I prefer satin. It was a quarter. <laughs> Yeah, no. <laughs> Starring Brad Pitt. No. Nope. <laughs> Michael Pitt, I'll have you know. Oh. He's not quite Here his Knight handsome so younger brother. I was just going to say, Brad Pitt's less talented younger brother. Oh, no. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> and then the, really, the coolest thing I got for a quarter here. Uh-huh. Spike Jones. Yes. Yes. Oh, nice. The work of director Spike Jones has a bunch of music videos, including... Sweet. Uh, I love Spike Lee. Sure Shot by Beastie Boys. <laughs> it's got... Sabotage by Beastie Boys. Spike by Daft Punk. It's the Spike yeah, Jones. Right. He's the guy who yeah, did yeah, In the Fuhrer's one. Face, right? What? He did her. Classic he did her. song from the 30s. No. Spike that Jones did her, him. bro. <laughs> and Where the Wild Things Are. I know. I know who he is. He did yeah. every point in the movie you've watched in the last couple of years. Uh, every, so this, uh, he did those I'll movies see. that I always say the title of the movie and then follow oh it gosh, with John. a deeply personal yeah. review. Mark. Yes, that's right. <laughs> so this also includes um, the Weezer's Undone the Sweater Song. Fat Boy Slim Praise You, Fat Boy Slim Weapon of Choice. That's the funny one. Uh, Feel the Pain by Dinosaur Jr., Sky's the Limit, Notorious B.I.G., Buddy Holly Weezer, Electrobank, Chemical Brothers, 
Buddy Holly Weezer? That's just side A. Side uh, B is a bunch of like short is there a record? documentaries. But does so, it oh, have him dressed up as an old lady? Well, there are six releases in that director's, <laughs> uh, what's called the director series. Spike Jones, uh, the guy who did uh, Spotless Mind, and what the fuck was his name? Michelle, oh, French, uh, French uh, guy. Michelle Gondry, thank yeah, you. Yeah, Michelle Gondry. Uh, Sean Cunningham, uh, there's three yeah, more I can't yeah, remember. He also did Ple Be Kind, Please Rewind. Yeah, there's, yeah. so there's, and all the first editions are double thick cases. That's a that's a that's a re-release, a thin case, a regular regu regular TV case. It was oh my twenty-five God. cents. Yeah, All it's cool. Oh, uh, great! Finally, They're hard to find. Five bucks, I got season three of South Park. Oh, Chip Pokemon! Oh. I've been looking Pokemon. for the those record labels releases actually. Awesome. Okay. Great. That really? <coughs> Next in line. Mr. Garbage Gamer, sir, what do you got? Apparently, Ooh, many things, you said. I have many things because I have two weeks' worth of backup. <clears throat> oh, awesome. Because I was dead to the world X. last week. I'm going to grab a handful of nuts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he has a handful of nuts now. And then I'm going I also to put... got Breath of the Wild. And then I'm going to put them Breath in my the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my tweet deck crashed. All right, so I'm just going to... Kind of go down the line here. <laughs> Fourteen things. That's what she mm. said. So no, the first I... thing I got was a new phone. <laughs> oh, very nice. I'm gonna. We need to learn to like mute people. Google phone. took that. Google took that feature away, so now we can annoy each other forever. Yeah. Thanks, Google. <laughs> is, is that a Galaxy Two? No, this is a uh, Nexus Six P. Oh. Uh, Why yeah, didn't I... you get the Note 7? I hear that one is just explosively good. <laughs> it's, it's warm. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I, I wanted to switch to a new plan. The other one I was getting fucked by. It was just, yeah. Anyway, new phone. Uh, Yay! So I uh, got some uh, Blu-rays here. The first one is I got uh, Godzilla vs. Megalon. Yay, yes. finally! Ah. Awesome. Nice. Cool. The thing that was supposed to go out of print but never did. You can now get your Megalon on. This is actually the very first Godzilla movie I ever saw. This, mm. this was my introduc introduction, along with a lot of people actually, mm. into uh, Godzilla. It wasn't the first one I saw, but it's the one I definitely saw the most. It was, it was the one on that, all the time. Yeah, it played in the U.S. and Canada like on repeat practically for like 20 years. <laughs> uh, like every other weekend. Uh, Next one is Destroy All Monsters. Yeah, that's the other one. Fucking A. Yeah, yeah oh, actually, yeah. these are sold uh, together on Amazon. Yeah. Oh, you got the... Oh, okay. Cool. You get the bundle so, together for most for each Jesus, Brian, will you fucking keep it down? Nice. Uh, yeah, so those... You didn't hear my chewing? <laughs> yeah, you're, like, jerking off with fortune <laughs> cookies. What? <laughs> 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 Holy shit. What did no, that hurt? Ow! Ow! <laughs> Oh, I didn't, I didn't really think the edges happy. would be this oh, sharp. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Something good's gonna happen to me next year. Oh! It's no, like it 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 it's 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 like I'm stroking myself with shattered glass. Oh, good fortune's <laughs> coming my way. Good fortune's coming my way. Anyway, uh, what? It's yeah. not truly oh, a good spank so session unless you're what bleeding the after. Hell is happening? <laughs> I have no idea. Just, just don't just come confused. into the fortune. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Talking about coming? Like I, like was, I wasn't days. talking about coming. That's Let like, that's going too couch. far. I was just talking about jerking off and bleeding. Somebody else said, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of fortune is this? <laughs> Saturday night is Why is the fortune stuck to the inside of the cookie? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Same reason why the friends, ladies and gentlemen. You take it out. You take the fucking the paper out. It can't get any worse than this. <laughs> I, do, I, do, I do appreciate all the sympathy. In the well, unless you there. eat the cookie you after. Started quack. <laughs> yeah, you're just sitting there eating some cookies. Cass, stop instigating. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, Cass. Jeez, it's all your fault, Cass. Moving on from <laughs> yeah, the guy who jumped in like four jokes later. La 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 la. Whatever. It's all your fault. <laughs> My friends, ladies and gentlemen. Uh huh. 
Anyway, so I picked up Spirited <laughs> Away on Blu-ray. Yay! That's a great movie. Finally, I have Spirited Away. My god! What the fuck, like, ass? <laughs> <laughs> so we, have a, we, we go from coming in fortune cookies to a Disney movie. Yeah. <laughs> That's about right. I was in the middle of my pickups, and out of, I don't know where you guys are talking about coming in fortune cookies. No, no one ever said coming about fortune cookies. <laughs> <laughs> That's your old man voice. Everybody say coming about coming in fortune cookies. <laughs> what? What'd you say? <laughs> oh, my face is purple. You said nobody said anything about coming in fortune cookies. What are you talking uh, about fortune cookies? Yeah, you know I can't eat those yeah, things because of my oh diabetes. My <laughs> Oh Sorry. <laughs> I didn't think it was funny either, but everybody else was laughing, so I just kept okay. going. Anyway, Spirited Away and... Spirited Away, Castle in the Sky. Yay! Yes. These were mostly, I was uh, uh, fulfilling my Disney obligations. Mm. I still need to see like, Castle in the Sky. Fuck ton of these movies. So you can cancel the count and not to worry about it. I think I have Exactly. Though. Yeah. Uh, also, I picked up. Uh, this was not part of the Hercules. obligation because it was really cheap. Uh, Disney's Hercules, the collector's special uh. edition, or whatever. Um, love this movie. Mm. Always love this movie. <laughs> so, the next one I picked up here is uh, Captain America's Civil War. Ah, yeah, I still need with, to get that one. With the slip cover, obviously. Yeah, 3D. Nice. Oh, awesome. I need that one. I need to get that one next, I think. Getting harder to find with this. Okay. I finally own yeah. Star Wars Force Awakens. Yay! And uh, I have, uh, I did pre order <laughs> Rogue One. Nice. So I have Rogue, Rogue One Rogue, all the way. Rogue Run. Rogue, <laughs> Rogue One. <laughs> Rogue One. Um, Alright, so that's the movies that I picked up. Uh -huh. <clears throat> the games that I picked up. I picked up uh, Uncharted, the Nathan Drake collection. Oh, nice. I have that. I haven't played it. Uh, cool. I have not actually started playing it yet either, so. But I, I want to get that when I get a PS4, actually. It was like, it was like 17 bucks. Wow. Oh, nice. like, you get all three games remastered. And... I have all three on PS3. I haven't played them yet. <laughs> and then I've been, this is the one I have been playing, and oh my god, it's amazing. Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh, god, Ooh. I want to play it. Oh, it's so good. I wish I had the Everything is good in this. The voice acting, the graphics, the controls, you know, the open world, this the everything. It's mass for <laughs> It's very well crafted. <laughs> so better than no man's <laughs> oh yeah. By by many, many miles. Many, uh, many miles. But it's by uh it's by Guerrilla Games. Uh so these are the people that did like the Kill Zone, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong, and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. All right, on to the bigger items. Mm -hmm. uh, this this went on a uh, flash <laughs> sale on Amazon. Not too flash. long ago, uh, actually. Ah. I like thank Quack. What the fuck is wrong? I like to thank no. I would like to thank Quack for uh, pointing this out and I actually running around and grabbing it while I could. That's the NES Classic Edition. Yay! So, I yes, need, I did I want actually. I one of those. I picked up four retail. Yeah, I want it. 50, 160 I'm bucks mad. for one. Wow. Man, I, I'm mad I missed out on that. <clears throat> yeah, it went on Amazon. And they had a bunch in stock <clears throat> and it went on sale for regular price for like what? Like an hour? Oh, wow. <laughs> like and 35 was, minutes. And it was sold out. And I just went around, turned around, and bought them. And Dude, I didn't have a it. chance to wait for the bank to get back from fucking lunch to check the cut because I could afford it. Wow. So, yeah, I have not modified it yet, but I do plan on putting about 119 games on it. Turns out I couldn't afford it, so it didn't matter. Uh, cool. It was a pretty easy process, apparently. Well, there you go. So, on the next one here, getting into the, <laughs> getting into the bigger stuff, speaking of consoles, I bought a PS4 Pro. Oh, Yay! Right. Nice. I need one of those. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah With one the... tuberculosis story. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I wanted God. to get a PS4 Pro because what is I going had on? Horizon Zero Dawn. What's going on? Sorry, it's my, my camera is really spazzing hard. Like, I don't know what the fuck is going on. 
I just saw it. I just did you saw see it. that? It turned into, like, into long face for a second. <laughs> yeah, I did. I got to know what's going on. Hey, hey, let's fight on Beef, 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 and all that. No, it's, no, it's <laughs> random. Yeah, I'm looking at the stream. Beef, yeah. beef, beef, and pork. It was just momentary. It was just a momentary. Oh, like, he keeps doing the momentary glitch. Like, like, I don't know what's going on. It's. All right, so, uh. so yeah, uh, the reason for picking up a PS4 Pro, obviously, was Horizon Zero Dawn. And uh, I have, like, The Last Guardian and Final Fantasy XV, so they will take advantage of the uh, Pro. And also, I got a 4K TV. Yes. <laughs> so I was now you just like, need yeah, the. Okay. Now you can get the PSVR and get uh, Ultimate yeah, VR. I, I'm really waiting mm. on the VR because I want to yeah. see just kind of how if it's going to survive and actually like be a long-lasting peripheral instead of just something that they had for a year. I don't know. And then it died off and they don't make shit for it anymore. But hey, you can you can watch 3D movies in it apparently. So that's something. Yeah, apparently we got that. In, do 3D. We got that in a PS4 update. Oh, well, there you go. Uh, so, um, good. So we'll... but I'm just saying is that that's one application that you'd be able to use it for for a long time. Yeah. You, well, you don't play a lot of games for it. You can watch 3D <coughs> Blu-rays inside the PS4? Yeah. You still need a 3D TV for it? No, no, no. You just need the, v the, you just need the VR uh, headset. It's all done through VR. So, oh, so, you, so you can just watch them in 3D, like just... Normal, so it sort of fills your vision, or you can watch it like so. It looks like you're in the middle of a movie theater, and you're watching it up on a screen. You can like look around and see the theater and stuff. That's awesome. Yeah. Okay, so, so the next thing I picked up here, um, <clears throat> which I've kind of shown off to the guys a little bit, is I got a projector. Yes. Another, yes. There you go. This is, and now it's not the most amazing projector in the world. It's a 720p <laughs> uh, projector, 3200 lumens. Um, by Simple. Lumens. Apparently it's the company. But it, it's a fantastic projector, actually. Um, it's cheap, too. Images, images, yeah, yeah, it was only $175. Which is cheap for a projector, in case you Yeah, know. and it's a, uh, it's a LED projector, so it's not those big bulb projectors. Yeah, the light will last a lot longer. Yeah. They last, uh, the estimated lifespan is 20,000 hours. Wow. Which is fucking ridiculous. When That's it comes a to lot of hours. <clears throat> Alright, so last but not least, I actually do need to switch cameras here. Oh. Right, oh. So. Hello, Eric's other camera. Hi, I'm over here. <laughs> so last but not least, to go with the projector, I didn't just get a sheet or anything like that. Okay. Yay! This right here. Screen, the pull way, down screen. This is 119 inches pull down screen, and it fills it. Wow, so cool! I could sit about six feet away at 119 inch screen. That's awesome. I remember when you first got it, you you were you were projecting it on a flowery blanket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just to get a scale of the size of the image. Ah, uh, okay. I had it on the only blanket I could find that was even remotely big. <laughs> So yeah, this just there you go. That's awesome. So is fucking he has a theater. In his I have a theater in my room. So Eric, <laughs> I think it's important that uh, you be sure that you installed that correctly. Um, so I see you. You sent me the instructions here to confirm. <laughs> yes. uh, so I'm just going to read the instructions. Ah. For the manual projection screen no. here that uh, <laughs> that Eric acquired, so uh, so let's see here. All right, so can I zoom in on this? No, hold on a second. Oh no, can I, can I zoom in? What what the fuck are you doing? Your zoom, your zoom is More broken. Difficulties, of course. Hold on, we go back. Okay, now that's fine. That'll do. All right, here we go. <clears throat> so, okay, so manual projection screen instructions. How to install the projection screen. Manual screen have to be installed on the best station of audience. <laughs> when you pull up the screen, the button of screen have to be on the head of audience. <laughs> 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 
the the screen right. the screen will be used for a long time if you place it <laughs> on the right station. What? Manual screen can be installed on the wall, also can be installed on the ceiling. <laughs> What? <laughs> oh, this is a great movie. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, wall screen. Have have hang ring on the two side. Nail the nail on the wall before you hang the screen on the wall. Then hang the screen. <laughs> oh, okay. I really thought I was just going to let us hang there. Yeah. That's the real directions. <laughs> this is the real yes. directions. <laughs> Send him a picture. Ceiling screen. When you hang the screen on the ceiling, have to nail two hook on the ceiling. Then hook the two hang hole. <laughs> the two hang hole. <laughs> Note: No matter what kinf of method of installation, have to make the unguff place what <laughs> to draw back the screen. After you used the screen, please close the screen. After you used the screen, please check the fabric of screen, whether it have dust and dirt. If it have this, please clean by the soft brush. <laughs> by the soft brush. Now, <laughs> this is important. Operate disturction. <laughs> what the hell is disturction? <laughs> Why? Disruption. One, Directions. open screen. Our screen have self-lock equipment. Opening the screen, pull Danau the screen slowly. Stop on the every station. Unlash your hand. <laughs> <laughs> the, screen, the screen will shrink upwards. Then screen self-lock the station what you choice. <laughs> what your choice, man. What, what you choice. What you choice <clears throat> important. <laughs> and finally, two close screen. When you cl when you close the screen, pull down the screen the slowly. The <laughs> self so <laughs> self lock equipment will auto diaplasis. <laughs> Auto diaplasis. <laughs> oh my god! Draft. Oh my god! I'm draft oh my god. the hand ring. Unlash hand after the screen closed on the housing totally. This sounds like a porn form. Note. <laughs> Note. Pull heavily. The screen will pull overly. When you pull down the screen, please note the strength of pull. Ge generally, when you look the when you look the back border is enough. <laughs> Metal housing, ingenious appearance, advanced self lock equipment, apply to all kind of installation place, etc. What, what do you mean etc? That was one item on the list. <laughs> <laughs> House cinema, recreation ground, teaching meeting, etc. Okay, you can't have two etc. Like, it doesn't work that way. Oh my god, <clears throat> Justin would just be killing himself right now if he had to edit this. Now, now, the, uh, now the, the added note to this, this wonderful manual, my dad actually looked at this legitimately wondering how to hang it. Uh huh. And we figured it out on our own. But, uh -huh. but the way it's printed, like, like, so here's here's the technical front. Yeah. There's the back, and it folds open to reveal absolutely fucking nothing. In <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, so this is just, yeah. Added well, that was... Bonus. <laughs> Duncan says, are these instructions for a contraceptive? <laughs> I'm just imagining the old people telling you, what do you mean I have to die of plastic? <laughs> yeah. What the fuck else is it, Cetra? Whatever, go press the input button and fuck off. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's the input button? Can't I just put the arrow button? I just like how first after it tells you that the screen has to be on the heads of the viewers. <laughs> that it doesn't tell yeah. you to mount it on the ceiling. So, <laughs> ow! And then you put it on the ceiling. Ow! This movie sucks. I'm never going to watch a movie here, please, again. <laughs> I get, it gives me a headache. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Well, that was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and so, yeah, that's my pickups. Oh, right. <laughs> I forgot what we were doing. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, Mr. Chris Aficionados. Holy crap, where is he? He's Good here. try. He's been so oh, quiet here. tonight. He must oh, be very on, I reload. He's lost. Not, I don't see him at all. He's deep not, in thought. <clears throat> I'm not be quiet. I just don't want to interrupt. Holy well, fuck, there's Chris. How polite. Dude, what a I'll polite motherfucker. For, last, for at least the last three minutes, I thought Chris had left. His nope. box is gone. Just, it was just he, a, he was just scared. watching the slow descent into madness. and. I guess there's not much surprise because she, you could see all the pickups to my left. Holy crap. Fuck. I thought that was just <laughs> stuff that had fallen off your shelves and you were <laughs> oh, <laughs> so overfull. We'll start small, I guess, with Blu-rays like everyone else. Okay. <laughs> so overfull. <laughs> Filled well, to overflowing. Put yes. that Blu-ray down. Nice. That Blu-rays Blu -rays are for closers. I sold the leads. Favorite I sold the leads. What am I? You fucking movie? child. <laughs> Five bucks at Target. Go pick it up. That's great. I gotta see that movie again. I, I haven't seen that in a long, long time. I would love a criterion of this. Me too. I'm surprised it doesn't I'll have one, fun. actually. It's a, it's a good hope, transfer. Yeah. It's I better than the uh, British one. There was like a UK <sighs> steel book, but that's region B locked. Ah. So for a long time, and then we finally got it. And apparently shitty anyway, so who cares? I hope the English prisoner <laughs> gets a freaking criterion. Release. The only yeah. Disney Blu-ray in the entire lineup because I'm running out of Disney titles to buy. Aha! Uh -huh. Boy Story. <laughs> Boy Story, eh? <laughs> With the Lego one. There's a big, there's a big. Of course, there's a slipcover. It's me. It's the yes. only reason I buy them. Very nice. How much to say? Good movie. Found it with a slip for cheap. Toy Story uh, 2 is great. Birdemic, shock and terror. Oh God. Oh God. And speaking wow. of the uh, I, diametric I, opposite of great. <laughs> no, no. I, I have no right to own the room on Blu-ray from Tommy Wiseau himself and not have Birdemic, Shock, and Terror and hide them. Well, yeah, that's... but you have Samurai Cop. I got, I get that too, but it's fucking expensive. Yeah. They just plunk thirty bucks down like a real man. It's actually only twenty on Amazon now. Really? Thirty bucks is a lot to spend on a shit. The room is hey, still like. I paid forty-five dollars for it, so mm. you're you. <laughs> You're crazy. You're crazy, man. Kickstarter and cheap. Well, bam, Twin Peaks. Yay! Uh, good set. We're now, in the middle of our first watch. Is that, yeah. the, is that the ten set. disc? That's the good set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Get this fucking thing open. There you Show go. you all. I forget I'm how it opens. Y'all insulting my set. Woo. Good set. Very nice. I still have a great set. Right. Uh, have a lovely set. It's fantastic. Have you watched it yet? Have you ever seen it? That's the one. That's the one I'm trying to find. I can't find. It. Chris, uh, have I ever seen Twin Peaks? Of course yeah. I have. Okay, we're, just checking. I'm only on season two, episode seven. That we're been. working on it. We're getting there. Getting Got a few more sessions about my set. The, the good set. <laughs> the good set. <laughs> David Lynch, <laughs> <Lynn's laughs> filmmaker. Period. Not that nine disc yeah, set put out for losers. No no that only losers get because they're losers. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the only screener in my selection. Fucking yeah, great 17. movie. I've heard it. Of 17. I have to see it. Uh, anything by James, well, produced by James L. Brooks, but should be good. Yeah. Effort, nice. Right? And uh, I did not take advantage of the Criterion sale, but I guess I should go with everyone doing Criterions. I picked mm. up one recently hmm. from. Oh, that's yes, I've got that one. Movie. That's yeah. a great movie. The yeah. single greatest documentary ever made. And I, I don't so know if good. that's like. A weird it's thing to say, but it's I, American I, movie is also up there. I've never seen American. Movie. Whoa! Crumb is fantastic. You're not and like to come back until you have. I have poignant seen Crumb, and enlightening three times. And also heartbreaking. Uh, Crumb is good in my life. Yeah, it is a wonderful documentary. I need to see it again. Oh, it's fantastic! It looks I, I have it's the great. same edition. We know it looks great. <laughs> Uh, DVD. Terry's wig off. What's funny? Director of Crumb also did Bad Santa. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> yes, Terry, my uh, And right. uh, Ghost World, which just got a Criterion. That's happened. right. That's right. Uh, Ghost World's great, too. I can't too. wait to get that on Criterion. Yeah. Jackass, the box set. Yes! Oh, hell yes. I cherish that set. I uh, Knoxville t-shirt, which I actually also just uh, got off eBay. <laughs> 
Now, I've been want. This is one of those sets where I I had it on my wish list for like since I made an Amazon wish list Forever. and I just never got around to picking it up. So it's like one day I'm curious, years. like, but like I'm curious, but I'm like I wonder how much it is, and I go on eBay. There's like this copy for five bucks. So oh, there you go, five bucks. I'll fucking buy it. It's the only one of the only jackass things I don't I don't own minus like the. Point fives and the lost tapes and all this other. Yeah, if you get the lost tapes, you basically have everything of the show, mm. and then the point yeah, fives, you have everything that, of the movies. What is it about MTV shows where they don't do like the same with Beavis and Butthead? I Just kind of understand sets. because they can't. Yeah. Yeah, they don't. But like with Beavis and Butthead, it's understandable because they have to pay exuberant prices for the music videos. For the music videos. So that, yeah. That's out of them. But like. They, they don't even put all the shorts. They're just, like, no. the ones Mike Judge decided, oh, these are the good ones. Well, actually, I think for the most part, all the shorts are there, like in, like in the new set. Um, but, again, it was kind of done like the Jackass ones, where they had the three volumes of the show, and then they had a uh, fourth volume later that had all the additional stuff. Yeah. So I don't think, I think there's... I what's annoying is that when you try to watch this in order, there's, yeah. like, things that people say that are, like, alluding to a previous bit that's uh, not even on the disc. Yeah, yeah. It's like the fuck is he talking? What? <laughs> yeah, that was there's... my big complaint when I first bought that set. I was like, <laughs> but oh I my guess God. the idea like, no. is that they just, you know, it's for people who you just want to watch your favorite bits. Yeah, so you select your. Fa- I, I guess I kind of get it, but the one thing, the one thing I do like about it though is that each disc is like three hours of bits, <laughs> just yes. like all strung together into one massive presentation. It went by so fucking quickly. I oh, have it's no idea. so great. I love that. Love that set. I guess the rest of the DVD pickup thing is sort of a Viacom is handed my money a lot, so we have a okay. complete series of Hey Arnold. Yay! Just right. never a big fan of that one. 20, 20 bucks at Walmart, can't go wrong there. There you go. And uh, probably one of the best shows, uh, a complete series of Avatar: The Last Airbender. Oh. Yes. Also, yeah, I might, I might grab cheap, that actually. I love the very very cheap cheap pickup at Walmart. <laughs> I love James Cameron. What they did a series based on the James Cameron show. film. <laughs> yes, there's blue per- uh, blue people you sex. Mean, oh, a, awesome. a series based off the it's M Night Shyamalan hit film. Avatar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, it's better. That's a bigger insult. Is that much? <laughs> I saw that. Now we got uh, video uh, Chris, games. How much was uh, Avatar? Video games. That was uh, that was about twenty twenty four bucks, I think. But wow. Both the, uh, it, nice. Basically, if you need at least at my Walmart, if you need a Nickelodeon box set, go to Walmart. They're dirt cheap. Cool. And considering how many seasons, depending on the show, it's a bargain. Like Angry Beavers is like four seasons. You get that for like twenty bucks. Cool. So pretty good price. Check that uh, out. Some PlayStation Two games because I got a PlayStation Two recently and got some games. Funny enough, <laughs> all these are like licensed games. So we got Fight Club, the game. Yay! Oh god. <laughs> Which I'm uh, I'm sure it's terrible, but it was a dollar at Goodwill. So why the fuck not? Maybe uh-huh. I'll make a video out of it. I don't know price sucks this one i am working on a video on so look out for that jackass the game that's a great game. i have that that is so fucking it is, hilarious it's good but it's only good for so it's, short a time it's very short yes it was well, well, that that's kind of like it, you can't really hate the game because like the game's not short you can't be like oh the story sucks jackass doesn't have a story it never did no well it's over before you know it so is the show in the movies exactly <laughs> It, it's a pretty good adaptation. It's but, exactly what you think it's going to be. But while it lasts, months. it's yeah, yeah it's, well, it lasts, it's hilarious. hilarious. Absolutely. My only biggest issue is it's very repetitive. Not yes. just like in its like the mini games tend to be s- similar, mm-hmm. but like they clearly did not keep the Jackass guys in the studio for very long. <laughs> I don't know how many fucking times their giant ox will go. Yeah, your mother effers. I'm surrounded by morons. It's the same <laughs> dialogue over and over again. It can yeah. irritate. <laughs> uh, this is the game I've been currently playing. It is so good. This is how you do a licensed game. Starface, the world is yours. Oh, Collector's yes. edition. Oh, nice. I remember. I remember that. Such a good game. game. It is I've... so so addicting. Have you got to the point where you swim? Them... Uh, yes, and Jaws comes up and he eats it. Yes. Uh, <laughs> basically, it's Grand Theft Auto. Uh, like any of them. That's actually a pretty cool game. game. Oh, That's... it's great. Cool. Uh, the I fact remember. that they, the, the late Robert Loja <clears throat> is the narrator for the game. 
and uh, Stephen Albert Bauer. Oh, you got yeah. the collector's edition too. Holy crap! Yeah, yeah. Were you not paying attention? I fucking no. I was. <laughs> I was on a. I was off in La La Land. Oh, oh, uh, no, you don't Dragon's understand. Man. You see, that's why I bought this fidget cube because that's, that's what happens. If I don't have it, I, I'm like, oh, what yeah. happened? Shiny. But no, if I, <laughs> the, the stigma of licensed games. I, I never see this in top like best licensed games. I really should. It's Taste nice. the it's rainbow. LJN. Uh, games that kind of went under people's <laughs> radar. Transformers. Uh, it's the Cybertron era, but it just says Transformers for some reason. I might as well get a good Transformers game after that terrible Oh, that one. one. with the tank controls. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I wanted to grab I've that one. I, just, I never got around like, to that uh, one. I heard for the longest time until, like, the war, uh, war and fall for Cybertron games came out, this was, like, the best Transformers game out there. I remember so, it looked pretty good from months. the previews I saw. The Warriors, which oh, I've also oh, heard great game. things. I played that That's one a so fucking much. great game. I, I, Rockstar, <clears throat> man. Unless it's Earthworm Jim 3D, you can't go wrong with the Rockstar. And yeah, comes as no surprise to anyone, I picked up a Switch and Zelda oh. Breath of the Wild. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I can't afford new How things. does the cartridge taste? <laughs> uh, <laughs> one thing this week. I, I decided not to do that okay. because I like myself. <laughs> I, don't, I don't believe you. I just sure don't get terrible, where things not, come from. You don't like yourself, don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> I like myself enough. Unless I do it on Fair. camera. And then Fair. Fair. Uh, Stout, what are you doing? How are you? Next person, go. <laughs> All right, cool. Gas, you said you have some pickups? Yeah, my... Okay, Mac. good. My Mac keyboard that I was using died, so I got a new actual proper computer keyboard. Yay! Okay. A proper computer keyboard with a numpad and everything. I don't even have a numpad. And now he's frozen. And now he's frozen. <laughs> <laughs> He's a key seen... There you go. You're back. Yeah, no, okay. you're back. I... All right. I guess because I was just moving the webcam. Mm. Um, the only problem is you may have noticed my mute coming off and on tonight is because uh, it's loud. Ah, it's well. way louder than the old one was. Ah. Where she goes, man. Way she goes. Anyways, that's my pickup. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad you yeah. got that. Awesome. I I know that's something you've been wanting for a long time. Actually, I have been wanting a proper PC keyboard again. Um, ah, okay, cool. Well, because the Mac one, for one thing, didn't have a print screen button, so being screen caps was... <laughs> oh, yeah, that's I think annoying. Sean is just trying to push your buttons. I <laughs> 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 Actually, my throat was really hurting from all the old people. That's what she said. Uh, from all the multiplication. Yes. Alright. So did you actually do your pickup? Yes. yes. Oh, okay. I am done. It has happened now. Skin slip. <laughs> Alright, first up, I won a contest on Twitter from uh, Master Video. They sent me over this promo photo from uh, Black Devil Doll from Hell. Whoa. Cool. Which is a That's very awesome. famous, uh, very well-known shot and video horror film. Uh, Massacre Video mostly does shot and video horror films. And they sent me over this VHS of uh, My Red Guts, uh, <laughs> Women's Flesh. I don't know any goddamn thing about this movie. It's sealed. It's going to probably stay that way. This is trade bait. Uh, cool. I didn't expect to win. I was like, yeah, sure. I'll... I mostly shared it so that maybe someone else would win because... I rarely win contests. All right. Uh, I, by the way, I only bought one thing for myself this week. Everything else is gifts. So uh, I got from my friend uh, Lene over in oh I forgot what country she's in. Anyway, she's a she's a front fan and uh, she sent this uh, coloring book of vintage comic book covers. Cool. So that's kind of cool. I colored the hell out of that. That goes over here. Uh, and then from Disney Movie Rewards, uh, for free, I got Wally, -E, so I can finally add that to my collection. Yay! Yeah. Nice. Nice. I got a pre movie to match your shirt. Yes, as as previously noted, uh, I, the X took all the Disney movies. So. Well, most of them. I, I stole a few of them when she wasn't looking. Anyway, um, next, uh, <laughs> I just had the slipcover because the Blu-ray is in the living room because folks are watching it. Ah. They picked up Hacksaw Ridge, and they, they only watch digital, usually, so... Yeah, I wanted to watch Blu-ray for the first watch, so 
got Hacksaw Ridge. That's cool. And then uh, Beggars Can't Be Choosers, and I got this edition of Doctor Strange. Yay! Uh, didn't pay for it. No complaints. I still want to get the Steel Book. Uh, I still intend to get the Steel Book at some point, but that would be nice filler until then. There you go. And the old what? I, was, I actually had to buy mine out of state, man. And by the time my person got there, it's like the last one. No, nah, so dude, I, it's cool. I ain't sweating. <clears throat> it's all right. Anyway, the only thing I actually bought for myself was Alice in Wonderland. Yay! Yay! Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's like it's my second. Naked. favorite. It's my <laughs> second favorite adaptation of Alice in Wonderland. What's your first favorite? The Jean Slankmeyer stop motion. <clears throat> Previous oh, fuck one. I don't think I've ever seen one that, that will that one that will give your child nightmares. That's the one I like the most. Cool. That sounds awesome. That's childhood trauma built in character. That's everything, by the way. <laughs> oh, all, all right, cool. Oh, oh sorry. What? I just happened for one sec. Sure. Okay. My other um pickup was I bought ten shares of Snapchat. <laughs> okay. Aren't you a little nice. late to that party? No, I just had its uh, IPO the other day, actually. Yeah. Oh well, it never mind then. I didn't realize it had not gone public yet. Steve. Steve. <laughs> All right. I can't do the other camera because everything seems to be very tentative and unstable. So you guys in the chat will just have to wait for the live stream to actually show you shit. So. All right. So I only got three, three Blu-rays this month. Or this month. This week because uh, it was rent week so not a lot of money to go around. So I got uh, Justice League Dark, the new uh, DC Universe animated film. I want to see that. So we got, uh, what we got here? We got uh, Swamp oh. Thing, Batman, Dead Man, uh, Black Orchid, Etrigan the Demon, and John Constantine. So Zartana. There you go. Huh? Forgot Zartana. He forgot Zartana. Well, she's not on the cover here, so. What the fuck? Unless uh, I'm mistaking her for Black Orchid, because uh, I don't see any message. That's Zatanna, of... actually. Oh, Never Zatanna, there it is. Then why Black is it? Orchid. Then why does it have a bio for Black Orchid in the special features and not Zatanna? She might be a villain in this one. I don't know. She's been on both sides. So. I don't know. Anyway, I got Justice League Dark, so I have not watched it yet, so I can't solve the Zatanna Black Orchid mystery. So. Yeah, and I also got Doctor Strange, the uh, 3D Marvel Cinematic Universe edition. That's Very fine. nice. I'll give you another look at it. It does have the lenticular thingy. Hold on, I'll show you. Never seen it. It actually uh, slips in there. Uh, I'll give you a better look at it here. There you go. So it's very nicely. Still seen half of the Marvel movies. Nicely 3D. Can we really like that strange. Very cool. And then, uh, and it's nice, nice clear case. And then it's actually, uh, it's actually a plastic slip cover, not, uh, not a paper one. So it's a little, little different, different feel to it. And uh, there you go. So very pretty. Cinematic. One of these universe. days, I'll catch up on the Marvel movies. Yeah, you should. They're fun. And I then, still haven't seen Age of Ultron. <laughs> Age of Ultron was good. A lot of people shat on it, but I actually enjoyed it. I haven't um, seen Age of Ultron and the rest, like, sin like since then. Ant-Man is Other a blast. Guardians of the Galaxy, Guardians of the Galaxy Guardians. is a blast. Yeah, I love uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. But... They've, they've been pretty consistently entertaining uh, since Age of Ultron, I have to say. Um, yeah. I, don't want, I, don't, I don't hate a single one of them. No, neither yeah. do I. Even Iron Man 3, which everyone shits on. Like, uh, Four, yeah, all right, man. All right, so so one uh, sad thing happened uh, recently. Uh, we lost uh, fan favorite character actor Bill Paxton uh, after complications oh, and really surgery. Oh. Uh, he was only sixty-one. Uh, most of us, yeah. you know, probably remember him from stuff like uh, Hudson from uh, Aliens. Of course, uh, he was in the original Terminator as one of the punks that first meets the Terminator. Um, Fuck you, he was in so much stuff over the he's years. He's killed by a predator, an alien, and a Terminator, and one of the only human characters to have that happen. Though that, Lance Henriksen is another that's true. person who has been at least destroyed yeah. or killed. So, himself. kind of, uh, you know, in in, in uh, tribute to uh, Bill Paxton, who's you know, uh, as I was, I'm sure he is for most of us, one of my favorite characters of all time. I finally oh. picked up Weird Science. 
on Blu-ray. This is complication to surgery. Too, where he man. where he plays uh, was it sort of the douchey older brother Chet? Yeah. 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 <laughs> Who's uh, he's just such the perfect douchey brother in this too. But uh, so this is the pop art collection edition. So uh, different cover art. I was kind of hoping it'd be the the regular poster art on here. Is it reversible cover? No, it's fucking bullshit cover. That's what it is. Anyway, this is, studio release. Not this, this is cover. perfectly acceptable, I guess. Uh, it's it's got a nice a, cover, though. It's got a few. Yeah, it's it's actually not bad. It's got a few cool special features on here. It's got a. It's alive. It's a four part retrospective, the theatrical trailer, and it has the pilot episode for the Weird Science TV series, which uh, I've never actually seen. So there you go. And that's it. That's all I, I got this week. Like well, just, well, let's hope it's not three. like the pilot for Revenge of Nerds. Mm. Yes. I wish we would get a DVD set of the short-lived series Misfits of Science. I really enjoyed that one. And why don't you marry it? That was a lovely fart, whoever had that fart come out of their you fart go hole. That <laughs> <laughs> uh, would well, be a time to raise your hands. I think that's it. Well, it was just funny because I was reading in the chat about vegetables, then I just heard. Somebody's been eating their bathroom stories. Perfect. Bathroom stories? I've got a few. No. Oh God. <laughs> Man, I haven't left my house. No, no, no interesting bathroom stories. Uh, let worry. me tell you about the time I went to the bathroom. bathroom, bathroom again at work while I've been using it. I'm gonna try to go see Logan in like a week or two, and then maybe I'll have an interesting bathroom story at the shitty bathroom. There you go. <laughs> So I was at the movie theater, and I had a dingleberry, and I accidentally wiped it over my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, uh, I, have, story ever. I have come to the conclusion <laughs> that at my workplace, we need more stalls in the men's bathrooms, because there never seem to be enough. I swear there are certain employees there who just never shit at home. It's like they're constantly in the stalls. Yeah, man, Dude. that's it, money on toilet paper. But it's like... What the fuck are you talking about? I was so, shit in the clock. So once in a while, I don't have time in the morning to shit before I go, so I wait until I get to work. So the other <laughs> so day you shit your pain. was one of those days... No, the worst, the worst is when I do that and then have to walk to work. So then at about halfway through the walk, suddenly there's the... Oh. And it's like, oh god! And it's like you feel that that sort of clump of it just kind of make the U bend and splash down into the lower colon. And it's like I'm ready now. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, well, I'm not. I've got ten miles left to go to work. Walking, clenching, trying not to be late. It's like that. That is the most horrible thing imaginable. It's like it feels like a fart, but I don't think so. Well, maybe. No, I'm not going to risk it. <laughs> it's a little milk duck. But, uh... You're making turtling. this like I'm turtling. A... I'm turtling. Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> but, God. So... You're, you're explaining it like it's a magic school bus episode. <laughs> <laughs> magic school bus. Let's travel up this colon. So, lower colon. <laughs> Splash no, down. Building, like in our... You know, our building is three floors. has... I don't know, probably a thousand people. Mm. But in our station section, we have one bathroom with one stall in the urinal. Mm -hmm. And just just right outside of our offices, there's a bathroom with about eight stalls and eight urinals. Ah. But I can't stand the asshole that feels the need to take a dump inside where there's just the one stall. <laughs> <laughs> and then you walk in and you just get smacked in the face with it. And it's like, come yeah. on, dude, that's a bad. Like, really? I mean, I get it. If he doesn't want to go to the other bathroom where we have this guy who walks in, every time I see him in there, he's, he's like washing, like he's scrubbing up for surgery. He like washes up to his elbows before he even goes to take a piss or shit. Yeah. <laughs> what? Really? Before? Yeah. See, See, that's just weird. Right like before he poops? Look, I, I'm sorry. Like, <laughs> I, I get like hygiene and all, but my asshole's a oh, dirty see. place. I don't give a shit about some dirt in my hands. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's just. Oh, that, that's just. Ones ones that, that, that guy's got problems. Know. I'm gonna reach up and grab it myself. But, but yeah. So like the <laughs> other, so like the other day, uh, uh, you know, it was one of those days where I'd gone in the morning. I had didn't have to do the 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 clinch walk. Thankfully, I, I was oh, taking God. took the, the bus. Walk, the, so the waddle. So I managed waddle. to make it as far as as my first break. 
So I'm like, okay, good. So we'll go, we'll go now. And then, uh, so I go, and there's a guy in front of me who I recognize from my team. You know, big kind of portly guy. And I'm like, fuck, no, no, please go that, go that way. Don't go into the bathroom. And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. And he just turned and went into the bathroom. I'm like, okay, fine. So I go and I'm like, walk. And then he kind of, he's turning and walking away. And he kind of almost bumps me. Oh, hey, how's it going? Yeah, hi. And then I see why he's turning away because he needs to use the stall. And the only two stalls that are there are currently occupied. So then he's like just casually do 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 walking <laughs> towards the stairs to go downstairs to the downstairs. Bathroom, like, ah, oh, fuck. Now I can't just like bolt past him because he knows that you I am also have. going to the bathroom. So bolt I'm like, fine. So I'm just kind of walking <laughs> casually behind him <laughs> down the stairs. And then he sees somebody else he knows, like at the bottom, he said, Oh, hey, how's it going? Blah, 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 blah. And I'm just like, Oh my fucking God, just, just go. I'm going to hang back a little bit, let you find your stall. And then I'm going to go what into the stall oh, next to you. And it's going to, I'm going to go like just sufficient distance so that you don't see that it's me going into the stall right next to you. But that's fine. We can, we can make this work if you just hurry the fuck up. So finally, he, he carries on. I go, hey, how's it going? And then goes, gets to the bathroom. And I go in, and already there's like two guys at the urinal. There's a guy at the sink. I'm like, holy fucking shit. It's like, it's a, it's a shit circus in here. So he, he goes into the big stall because he's a big guy, and and then uh, you know I see that the oh, okay good the little one is the little one is free so I go into the little one and I hear him already unbuckling sitting down just having the nastiest <laughs> wettest shit imaginable, and then I look and it's like oh whoever was here before didn't flush so I go and flush, and the water starts to rise. Oh. I'm like no. <laughs> The one oh, no, stall no. in the entire building, and it's clogged. I went to all this trouble to avoid knowledge of me being the other guy in the stall. I'm almost at the end of my break, and I'm like, fuck, like, I can't do this. <laughs> this just is not in the cars for me. So I stomp back upstairs, and I'm like, Maybe the other one's free now. So then I go into the other, uh, the upstairs bathroom, and magically they're both suddenly occupied. It's like, what was this? Just the universe having a little laugh at my expense? Like now it's yeah. all fine. At least you know, at least the seat was warm when I sat down on it. So that was kind of a nice consolation. But yeah, the, yeah I always find it pretty <sighs> unsettling at the same time when it's like you enjoy that the seat's warm, but then you remember why it's warm. Yeah. You the worst. I done if I were you. The worst is when it's wet. He starts walking <laughs> towards the other side. <laughs> is it water? Do, or is it pee? Or is it go, shit water? You just Sorry, go, you just yell gangway and you blow past him with your hand on your ass. <laughs> and he's not gonna say shit. You're like, whoa, that guy had some serious shit. <laughs> Plus, if you get away, you just fucking just fucking check him to the wall. Just, yeah. Oh, oh, sorry, I had to go. <laughs> Just be like your chapters, guys. I have to shit. <laughs> I, just, I, just I gotta poop, one. I gotta poop, I gotta poop. I was just like, <laughs> hate the song, yeah. I just hate when I'm like, in it, going into the restroom and like the one stall is open, just has shit all over the place. <laughs> but in the middle, but in the middle of the shit, and like, man, I'm not gonna clean all that up. In the middle of all of it, there's a fucking cigarette that was put out. So they took the shit. <laughs> Didn't flush it. It's all over the seat. But they did put out their cigarette. <laughs> so you shoved um, it up your ass. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, no, the thing you're talking about, Sean, the, in the morning is like, you know, I think it might be a fart, but I'm not sure. But, yes. Um, I guess, I, no, I get that in the morning a lot, especially mm -hmm. as I've talked about before, using this cat machine. Yeah. You know, being hooked up to a machine pumping you full of air for eight hours. Um, <laughs> I do have to fart a fair bit in the morning. Um,. <laughs> And the problem is, I also tend to have to poop in the morning too. So uh -huh. you know, it's a lot of trying to figure out what's what. <laughs> it's like it doesn't like, feel like it has any weight to it, <laughs> but yeah. Well, and I'm also not one of those people where it's like I can poop like the moment I wake up. Like I need yeah. to kind of be awake. Oh, that's and, usually my alarm you know, clock. I need a little bit. Like of... Oh shit! You can't. I'm awake. It depends. Yeah. Sometimes I can go like with my morning pee. It's just like it's just ready. 
Yeah, and, I do but, that sometimes too, but sometimes it's like... But other times, other times it's like, no, I can do the pee, but eh, no, the muscles haven't quite woken up yet down there. Yeah, so. they're not quite ready to go. And then the problem, <laughs> too, is I have a nearly hour drive to work. Ah. So like, by the time I get to work, like, my bowel is just feeling, like, inflated. Like, I mean, there's yeah. things that need to happen. <laughs> so I, I usually do the awkward walk from my car to the front door to... <laughs> poop bottle. Poop bottle. Letting poop out bottle. those All little little and bits like, of air. Well, that's just what it is. I'm venting, but I'm like doing that weird like push the muscles a certain way so as to not apply too much force. <laughs> just a lower sphincter. Like just trying to just push the fart past. And, and this is the part of the story where you say, "And then I coughed." <laughs> then I shat myself violently. That has happened before. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh crap. That's why you need oops. oops, I crapped my pants. <laughs> um, yeah, well, and then the other thing, too, is of course, I don't want to just show up for work and say good morning and then just beeline for the bathroom. Hi, how's it going? Be, <laughs> I want to try and be productive for a few minutes to kind of give the illusion that I'm there. <laughs> that your but, mind isn't on emptying your bowels as soon as possible and nothing well, else. Yeah. But yeah, it's like I go to the bathroom. And yep, really I'm glad to be here at work. Good morning. How's it going? <laughs> hey, Cass, why are you holding your pants like you're trying to hold something in? Nothing. I'm just... I'm, this is the way I crunch numbers. <laughs> oh, God, something's crunching. Uh, but, uh... <laughs> Some big numbers. <laughs> Oh boy, that's gonna be a lot of numbers. <laughs> <laughs> that's a deuce. I don't know if I can divide these. <laughs> <laughs> Look in the bowl. Oh, it doesn't balance. Oh god. Um, that shit is so have to credit that. But no, the problem is then when I do go to eventually have the morning poop at work, um, the bathroom availability is really an issue. Like, we have just few washrooms on our floor, and they're like, you know, one person washroom. Mm -hmm. So it's good. So, I mean, nobody really sees you go in to a stall or anything like that. Yeah. Um, but the problem is, I still have all the leftover air from the CPAP. So it's like when I do move, it like, shoots out like a bloody pressurized cannon. <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> And then usually the poop is followed by then all the air trailing. So I mean, I just I, I just like, pray nobody's walking by so the washroom whenever I'm in there. So so how does pumping air into your ass all night prevent you from snoring? <laughs> the air has to go somewhere. Oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> I don't think it's pumped into his ass. <laughs> You're so focused on not farting for fear it might be a shit that you don't consider snoring. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> the distraction technique. <laughs> no, I seriously do. Like, I, I, I wake up some mornings and I just have, like, three, four, five second long farts just to, like, <laughs> evacuate all the air. <laughs> Morning ventila ventilating. Waking up and <laughs> or there's one that seriously was about a five second count. No, it's just like holy shit, it's still going. <laughs> the kind, the, the kind where you actually feel yourself deflating. Oh, you feel yourself deflating, you're like, oh, and then there's the, <laughs> then there's the, <laughs> we, we, for, yeah. oh, gosh. <laughs> uh, the worst is when you're laying in your bed, and you're dead awake, and suddenly it's like, five alarm fire, you're about to shit yourself right now, and you're like, up, jolting, you're straight standing up, and you know if you, you gotta go right now, but if you run, you're gonna shit yourself. So you have to, like, you have to do the poop waddle, but you got to do it yeah. in such a way that you're literally barely on your one foot by, by the time you're going to the next one. You're like poop waddle running. Yeah. Like, oh, you're just doing this <laughs> this this action down your hall. Like, oh god, oh god, yeah. oh god. Just must keep the hole and, closed. And you got to aim just right because as you're sitting down, before you even fucking got the seal, then it's already coming out. You just can't yeah. stop it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, quickly quickly drop and make the seals. I was upstairs in the kitchen, like, chatting with 
my, some of my housemates on that, and suddenly I was like, okay, I know I really need to go to the bathroom. And what's funny is there's a bathroom right beside the kitchen, but I didn't want to go there because I wasn't sure what found them. <laughs> you know, while everybody's How like, appetizing. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, just enjoy that chili beans and dip, and I'll just be right over here. <laughs> <laughs> so I went down the stairs, <laughs> and as soon as I got to the bottom of the stairs and knew I was like out of earshot of everybody, I was farting all the way from the bottom of the stairs to the bathroom. <laughs> With like each step, it rocket was like, boost. Don't use that toilet; it's broken. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. like the, the beginning of the Beetlejuice theme song. <laughs> Well, no, and what I hate, the kind of like what Brandon was talking about is, like, when you have that, like, you go from a zero to a hundred instantly, you know, like, I need to go now. Oh, yeah, dude, yeah. It's like but, a yeah. turbo. <laughs> yeah, when there's so much poop that has to happen, and you sit down to go, and then the poop itself ends up acting like a plug, because it all tries to come out at once. <laughs> <laughs> like, Take turns, people. Poops. One at a time. Get in line, you bastards! Mm. <laughs> it's like our talk about processing the breakfast instantly. It's like the piece of toast coming out and getting wider <laughs> as it comes down. <laughs> it's like, oh god! I thought it was just a sausage link. <laughs> <laughs> I like Derek's take on that. Like, <laughs> it would, it was, it's fairly poop shaped. It's just there'd be no resistance. It would just shoot right in. <laughs> This has been a pretty shitty conversation. Ha ha! Ha ha! Ah, it's terrible. And I killed this. Oh, right. Oh, right. Yeah, right. I succeeded in killing the momentum. All right. Yep. Yeah. Momentum killed. Time for bed, kids. <laughs> I think we're done. All, all your damn fault. <sighs> I'm spent. Hey, Zach, why don't you go catch a Cuda? I'm not going to cut back to the title, because that seems to be what's crashing it every time, so we're just going to end it here. Uh, okay. So have yourselves a wonderful week, everybody. No Twitch tonight. I have to work in the morning, so sorry. We will Twitch again soon, I promise. I don't know when specifically, but we will, because all, all the stuff I did on YouTube is starting to run out of episodes. <laughs> all right. So you catch it. Because the opening is to finish. Uh, oh yeah, I do. I have two actually to do that I still have not done yet. So, <laughs> closer looks. <sighs> there's closer looks coming. Reviews. There are more closer looks coming. Those at least I did in advance. So there's another one coming tomorrow at 6 p.m. Pacific. So enjoy. Whatever it is, I know what it is. But you guys are. Okay. And what? Lick my bowels. Lick my bowels. <laughs> I'd, I'd rather not think. Doctor, it got really creepy really quick. Why are you gonna review the Transformers Matrix set? I, I did already. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, when are you gonna finish the Doctor Who? Doctor Who? Eventually. Maybe in time Where for the hundredth you know? anniversary. When are you gonna do a DVD to Blu-ray comparison? In VHS. <laughs> When's your 4K ranch coming? Oh god. Really wanna know what you think about 4K? Well, it's it's more higher word definition. Enjoy. <laughs> it's better than Blu-ray. Shut the fuck up. It's there better than Blu-ray, but you need a big TV. That's what I think about it. <laughs> the color's really nice, pop apparently. <laughs> Do you eat hot pockets, son? Yep. I make. Where's them. the input? I make Texas hot pockets. <laughs> or no, Alabama it's Alabama. Hot Alabama right. hot pockets. Sorry. <laughs> oh, is it Texas Prairie Dog? Something Prairie Dog. Oh. Hey, Kirtland. Kirtland. Are you the two boys up here whacking in my tool shed? Whacking. Whacking. Whack. All right, now we're just being random and silly. Let's go away now. Have yourselves a wonderful night and a wonderful week, and we'll see you when we see you. Go fuck yourself. Warm, delicious oh, Alabama hot pocket. Mmm. <laughs>